forces ennemies détectées. Dégâts critiques au moteur. Alerte incendie. On a coulé un destroyer ennemi. Problème résolu, chef. You kidding me this whole time? Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't want to open up on that. I didn't want to open up in the double gearing division, but our clever, our, the clever, our friendly division mate was dying. And we had to do something to try and support him as best we could. Oh god. Yes, thank you. Thank you for the welcome there. Yeah, I needed that. I needed that. Uh, Mike, check up. I did not know. <clears throat> I was talking this whole time. Jeez. All right, hello folks, this is me, uh, nothing happened, totally, totally not intentional. It's not like I was streaming for 10 minutes without my mic, totally not, not the case. Oh god, we don't even have a gun. Don't even have the guns, we're gonna die! Uh, oh. We didn't go out completely empty-handed. Steer maximum professionalism. Sir, you're lucky you're still a mod for that rootiness. Whoa! All the DDs are done, sir. Don't have to worry about it. Alright, that was a not good start. We did take out both our DDs, but... Yeah, a little bit of mess up there. Let's back out of this one. <laughs> we should do okay, though, to be fair. We got, we got both the DDs taken out. You know, we did a fair amount of work there. Let's go. Ooh, should we go this way? Let's go. Yes, we should. We should. 7.6 Kaba. But who gives a damn when you have 16% fire chance? Oh, yeah. You're not going to need any of my opinions, sir, because this is my stream. What are you doing? Getting your opinion for some stuff later tonight? Have you ever heard of messaging me? You don't have to message me in the bloody stream, sir. You crazy man. <clears throat> but fine, we shall do so. At some point, maybe. Jaden boy. Yeah. How is everyone doing? Sorry, I, the whole mic's been off. I'm just, I've been talking for the last eight minutes and none of it's been heard. So I'm like, oh my god. Oh well, we'll get there. See. <clears throat> We're in arena still, yes we are. God, I'm forgetting everything. The boy is Nichinaiza. We got double Shima, we got the Kaba. Oh god. I don't want to hear any more, sir. 
don't need to hear any more about this. You start creeping me out. Why do you like the CC cam on this thing? I think I had the other cam. I have maxed out the other cam. Why would I put that? Very surprised here. I need to take a look at my camel here. I don't think I've got this high. It shouldn't be this high. It doesn't really matter, but like it shouldn't be this high anyway. Oh god. The one battleship that's most scary to me, that's the one I fight, because that's that's typical, you know. And in Alaska, that's not pretty. It was never an inspiration, sir. As the saying would go, you're talking piffle. Really, that's a nasty shot. I quite like my modules, Mr. Alaska. I'd appreciate you not breaking them every five minutes. Oh god, the fires. Surprise is not a triple fire to be honest. Jockey! Got a promotion at work on Thursday, my telehander licensee thingy too. Oh wow, jeez. Good job, Jockey, my goodness. Also, hello and welcome. How you doing? This is our chillaxed mayhem chaotic stream here because uh, the sort of ships we'll be playing will be high DACA, high intense, high octane ships. We're just going to do nice and chill. I get that fire going before we switch to AP. Uh, one more salvo for good luck. There's the AP. We're not spotting for our team though. At the minute, Alaska is not a massive threat, so we're actually pretty good here. See how bad our turning circle is, it should be pretty bad. We have a destroyer in mix. Not really interested. You can fight me on your own, you can fight me over there. If you want to do that, that's fine. Not really interested. What is that? Alaska? Yeah, it's probably Alaska. Every single cruiser you fight is in Alaska. Every time. It's without doubt. It's without fail. No problem. It's just constant. I'm 
really want to fight me? Do you really want to fight me? Like, you really want to do this, buddy? Alright buddy, it's your funeral. Yeah, I didn't ask you to die, but I'm more than happy to oblige. I'll fight you. There we go. Any other takers? Need to try and get in that cap. It's contested, that's good. See what's going on here. I kind of want to hurt La Yamato. Alaska is pretty clutch and dangerous, so there's a lot of a lot of scary options here. Really, we gotta give some caution to the wind. Some caution to wind? No, don't do that. Honestly, I know AP would be really good here, but we want to get those fires because it's, it's Yamato and it's got a lot of large health pool. Are you going to turn to things? Turn? Chill, sir. This is the chillest of chill streams. What are you talking about? Well, sir, it's not over yet. Alright. Did a fair amount. <sighs> Picked up. Alright, okay. So, technically, the red team could win this. The Shimikaze pushed me, and just. The Shimikaze is such an easy target to kill. You know? You take Stalingrad into the arena with Foggy, and that bow cross bow and crossfire is filthy. Yeah, it's, it's. I have the Stalingrad too, but it's not as. I can play it. I'll play it next, maybe. But um, the the only issue with Stalingrad is you need to be very careful. Didn't recognize that. You see, we got a mining platform there. Another one as well. Very small. Pretty weird mining town that is. Alright, so yeah. Uh, Red Dark Delta team should win, but we've got a pretty solid chance of getting the results here, you know. Alright, we'll go back to port, sir, and we'll see what's cracking. <clears throat> Thank you everyone who's popped in, appreciate it. Uh, Potato, I got your message, and I will uh, fix that at some point when I have a minute. I think 
here, go here. It's unsettling that every time, everyone who's joined so far, at least patience in the thing. Everyone that is, uh, joined so far as a mod. I need to demod all the people here, I swear to god, must be something of the sort. Lovely people, don't get me wrong, but like, I feel I have too many mods. <clears throat> What did we say we were going to play? Oh yes, Salingrad. Oh yeah, Chalky, for your sake, for your eyes only here. I went with Sharnhorst. What did I go with normally? Oh, I went with Minbelli for Reload. Phantom Bane here. I went for Sharnhorst or Norman Scott. I'm not sure which one here. I'm feeling Norman Scott's the way to go. Norman Scott, yeah. Oh, beyond Range, Intuitive, Punch Through, Fear, My Roar. I need refill station for a little bit more reload, so I get a pretty spicy reload. <clears throat> okay, chant translation, trying to avoid talking to Celestos. Sir, what are you doing? What is your goal here? Hmm? What is your goal? You grumpy man. Anyway. Oh. Very grumpy one, didn't they? I've never heard so much weird conversation in, in the stream. Don't get you, sir. Alright. We shall play this down, Grand C. We got good neighbours. Because they have becoming good friends. <sighs> That's a lot of Alaskas. Holy crap. Honestly, I feel Stalingrad is only slightly better than Alaska, but Stal Alaska has some significant advantages over Stalingrad, which is kind of upsetting. Like, AP on Stalingrad is without a doubt better, but it's not by much. <clears throat> also, the HE. Having HE on Alaska does give it that a little bit more advantage. You'll do probably, you know, you've got that advantage there. Very viable radar on Alaska that is, you know, 30 seconds is even better. Uh, we're going to get this one here. Which one are we going for here, guys? Can I go for that one? There. There we go. But yeah, no, you've got that. Tankiness Alaska wins in terms of being devstruck, but it loses out on sort of ability. Sustainability, Stalingrad is right there, but if you catch an Alaska broadside, as opposed to catching the Stalingrad broadside, Stalingrad will eat guaranteed citadels and death, whereas Alaska can get easily overpinned because the citadel is right there, you know? And sometimes, I swear to God, it doesn't exist as well. It's pretty darn bonkers. <clears throat> so, yeah. Risky, indeed. I'm getting in broadside. Uh, sorry, Chunky. gonna keep turning away and you see the perfect broadside shot over pens mostly and we've got pens yeah again like considering what's potentially there how you doing mr. Dax I don't feel the Alaska is really much weaker than Stalingrad at all I think it, they're very competitive I think Alaska is borderline better in a lot of cases actually that's the sad part about it considering this is worth 2 million XP Yeah, I don't know. I feel like the AP should be on Alaska is way too good as it is. I don't think there's a need for that sort of level of insanity that is AP Alaska. I think it's an incredibly strong ship and really could use a little bit of a nerf. 
because it's kind of stealing the thunder of another ship. And I'm all about giving like each ship its own strength and weakness. That is a Yamato. But Stalingrad is better DPM in Alaska? No! Look at that. 6k and I was completely angled. I'm in one of the tankiest ships in the game. I mean, I hit my superstructure, so I'm a little bit annoyed at that, but like still. I'd be trying to get this heal, but I can't get it. Just, just, I just can't risk myself too much to get it. It's so risky. And we're the only ones who don't have a heal. And we're going to beat ourselves. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. In order to get this heal, I have to get broadside to these Alaskas, and it's just not something I want to do. I'd love to hear Chalky's opinions on this, because Chalky loves the Alaska Stalingrad. Maybe it's just me, you know? One on one, though, I think I can kill a Stalingrad. But that, again, the problem is fighting a player of equal skill and, you know, the same situation. Like, there's two Alaskas here. I'm having to give this guy a broadside, I don't want to do it, but I have a choice. That was a bad shot on my part. I'm only giving a much broad side as I can afford because they're not shooting at me. Plus you're genuinely a much more... Ow. Can't push any more forward, buddy. You gotta, kill, you gotta hold my ground here. Like he's giving flat broadside. Like that's that's a broadside right there. That should be Citadels, but no. Oh god! Oh god! And look, he just breaks my guns as well. It's something Alaska is really good at. No, 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 no. Again, Solista, that's not the case. Stalingrad is not as good as breaking turrets as Alaska is. Alaska is actually god tier doing that. Like I'll even go for it just for the sake of it. Prime example right there. Look at that angle and look at the citadels and there's my death. Uh, Alaska is just completely... Yeah, I don't know where you get that one sir from. <clears throat> okay, sir. Um, are you aware this is a arena mode, sir? You know, you have to actually have to fight enemy ships. Like, you know, I'm not interested in just hanging around sniping until the thing happens. You know, you got to get in there. You got to do something. At least this Yamato's got the heal. Got the heal. You know, he's trying. Don't know what you're doing back there behind an island, sir. This is arena mode. I swear you should. They should make the map smaller for arena. To be fair, I was fighting too. Yeah, but like, you saw every, not a single citadel on them, and they were basically broadside. Got remember, Stalingrad's got improved pen angles as well. Alaska's got better improved pen angles. I'm almost certain about that. And we didn't get anything, any luck. And he had a he had got a citadel at a greater angle. We shot him. We shot his gun turret. We kind of missed it, I think, or another like that. Actually, we might have missed it. We might have gone in there. I'm not sure. Feel free to rewind the stream, but he broke our turrets about three or four different times. It's pretty bonkers. And this is like, watch this. Boom! Dev Strike and a La Yamato. Yeah, just Alaska is bonkers. Really is bonkers. This is unfortunate. Unfortunate game. I'm sorry, Chalky. But yeah, we'll play Alaska and we'll show you the difference here. We don't need to run AP Fuse with Alaska, we'll just run what we got. And yeah, go like this. You want to let's div division up using Moon Cookies? Uh, maybe next game. Yeah, next game we'll division up. If you're up for it. I'm just chillaxing, so we can do that.
Yeah, it was pretty pretty rough. So we've got a nice looking Alaska skin here. Alright, what do we got? Alaska, 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 Alaska. So many Alaskas. A lot of Yamatos and Conquerors. Yamato Conqueror kind of messes up everything though. Like, yeah. If you're interested in hanging back, then yeah. I, I, I can I can go to standard to right, cookie. I'm, I'm not really I'm not really got my heart and soul set in arena. I'm just doing a little bit to get myself uh, in the top twenty five. I think I should play this game and then quit it. Then I should be relatively high ranked in terms of that. I don't suppose many people will be interested in arena second season. Uh, ten kilometers nine point seven nine. We're going this one here. This thing's bonkers, bonkers. It's so good at breaking turrets. It's, it's one of its big, biggest things, Alaska, is actually breaking turrets. I can't stress that. Jackal, in my opinion, this boat is not worth it. Yeah, I, I, I kind of agree. There's nothing really much worth it. Unless you're adamant to get the line, then Arena's really not worth it. There's not really good enough rewards, to be honest. I have to agree, 100%. <clears throat> I do think uh, if you try to get a line, you're going to have to work your butt off to get this boat to get a, to get a line. It's a good boat, to get me wrong. And if you like British battleships, it's pretty much, pretty much the best thing there is, besides the Conqueror, of course. There's a tier difference for a reason. But yeah, no, it's, it's, it's by far the best, I think. It is by far the best. So yeah. But uh, yeah, it's going to be tough. It's, the lines are... I think it's one of the most, it's one of the hardest boats to get in terms of uh, like the exclusive ships, like Lennon wasn't too hard because you could buy a bunch of crates and every crate you bought you got stuff from it. This time though you had to buy certain crates and you don't have the option. There we go, 16 key off the bat. Uh, let's go murder in Alaska. Can we do that? Dispersion's pretty bonkers. Break a turret, because we just said that we could do that, because that's one of the things they can do. We got a Yamato here, that's pretty scary. We're gonna ping him for our peoples. We're gonna shoot him in the wee weak spot, hopefully. Right about there. Oh, we didn't get the result we wanted, but that'll do. Here, we're gonna fire another salvo here. I can never get the firing right on the on the on the that pain angle, but yeah, I didn't get too great on it. Conqueror's just going for it, man. GG, buddy. I always like the aggressive play. Probably too aggressive in this situation, but hey, you know what? I'm gonna support him. Again, another break of a turret, because that's what Alaska do. I'm aiming for the Citadel, I'm not aiming for the turrets, it's just, you know, it just happened to be the similar spot. Now I'm aiming for the turrets 100%, that's aim for the turret right here, and... Enemy cruiser destroyed. Doesn't really matter what you're fighting, the Alaska is pretty bonkers. The hell's happening to my turret? You see this? Oh, oh, you returned to me. Okay, good. Turret returned to me. I can afford to get a bit more broadside because they're brawling each other. I'm going to make this an unfair fight as much as possible. Break these turrets. Aimed a little bit high there. The best up there. That was the best up there. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Arena's great for making money? Yeah. yeah. Hold on. I've, I've kind of messed up. I, I really potatoed there. 
Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, that was just a straight potato. And like, can, he should have killed me straight off the bat there. I'm just gonna say that. Shoot him. I got four pens. It just. It's just like, I should not have won that fight, but I did because it's Alaska. Alright, 11.7. I can go dark. Can I go dark? Yeah, he's not even shooting at me. I can go dark now. Yeah, every, uh, quick games. Good amount of money. High damage. So yeah, I mean, it is great for making money. And it's also good for gathering XP as well. Because arena games are, tend to be more... Uh, what do you call it? <clears throat> uh, getting uh, higher XP. Their service costs are much higher than Legendary though. You had to be like decent at the game. Not, good, not to be mean to anyone, but you just got to be pretty darn good in order to get a result off it. And look how much we can heal as well. The improved heal is just not even needed, but we have it anyway. I'm, I'm a turret down by the way, and we'll see what we can do here. Here we go. Can we get a last? Can we get Yamato? Best thing to do right now is probably give him a flat broadside and hope he overpains us. Oh, I can never get the Citadel right, I swear. This is hurt though, quite a bit. I'm going to get greedy. I'm getting greedy! I haven't played Arena yet, that's a fantastic repair, that's something be... Well, the legendary tier though is pretty bad in terms of earning credits though. Huh? No, no, no. Yeah, yeah, well, I don't know actually. Do you know what? Honestly, I take my point back there. I think you're right. What's that? Pretty good dude. Um, I think, uh... Wow, look at the healing man. We can heal so much. I think the legendary, the credit earning should be should be pretty decent. If you assume you can pull out a decent game, and it's not really hard to get up a decent game in this mode because uh, the experience gain is pretty bonkers, especially if you get a game where there's all healing, you know, like if you got infinite heal because you can pull off like 300k games, no problem. <clears throat> yeah, the legs are yeah legs have enormous surface cost. Yeah, but with these modes, if you're like getting a consistent like 200k every game, or around about that number, then you might get some decent work done. Oh, we're gonna lose this one, but... I potatoed really badly and I really didn't... I, I paid for it by one to gun turn 22k and that's... it's alright, you know, it hurts, but... end of the day, like, it's not the end of the world. I'm still alive, I'm still kicking. Chucky, if you're still here, I want to know, what do you think? What is better, objectively, Alaska or Stalingrad? Because I honestly think Alaska is better overall. Though Stalingrad does have the superior AP, but realistically not by much. Because, like, survivability, Stalingrad wins on the, survive on, on the on sustain, but immediate damage, Alaska is very... Very difficult to actually get work, make work. Conquer is gonna hurt me pretty bad. Let's get hurt. Actually, better than I thought it would be. The ship is on fire. Yeah, Alaska over Stalin. Yeah. See, we're getting penned there, that's pen damage. I think I might go for the round here. Up, oh wow, didn't have a chance. Didn't have a chance, because they were capping.
All right, so there's no one is better, is what Chalky was saying, is like comparing Call of Duty and Tarkov. Alaska is better at doing cruiser things, like taking caps, hunting DDs, while Stalingrad doesn't do cruiser things very well, because more a battleship than a cruiser. Do you go on Dead Strike? We didn't get the Dead Strike, but yeah. <clears throat> there's the money, we only made 50k that game, but we didn't do that very, to be honest. Considering where we are in Alaska. Alright, let's take a look at the old games here before we Vemanos from Arena. We're losing them, not doing too great. Stalingrad only did 100k, we made 54. What's the service cost? 172, look at that. Kabarosk, we made 421. We have pretty pretty good game. Club Bear game, I have no doubt we lost that. Our Yamato is still alive, probably hang back. These guys did all the work. We made hundreds. Of, yeah, he can make decent credits with DDs, but you have to do decently well. Let's see if Moon Cookies is up for it. Uh, da, da, da. I can't see that, can you? What's Rambo doing? Is Rambo on? Can bring Rambo on here. Maybe let's bring Rambo in here. Sorry guys if you can hear the fan there from my laptop. Oh Rambo okay, he's doing his own me thing then. I'll let him do his own me thing. <coughs> So we played all those games and we've got really everything we everything of value because uh, all we really want from the big is the Rumble Shimmy as well, yeah he is. Yeah, we got everything of value over this arena mode session to be honest. Top 50% we get the gold crate, so yeah. That's pretty much all we really want. I mean I'd rather not play have quite a few more games just to get seven promotion orders one second here. And a commendation, I'd rather not. So let's just go standard. And oh, let's take a look at that thing here, Cabaros. Okay, we have the right build. Yeah, we've got the right build fund. Thank you for Okay, we shall play. There we go. We'll go for the Melio. Which one will Melio? Mm. Yes, we'll go Melio. Yes, Melio it is. <coughs> yeah, Stein gets to talk and let's go. Uh, can you try Baltimore? Oh, I'll do Baltimore next. No, I have to worry about Exile. Baltimore is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Really is a strong boat. Get, oh, we got Be the Chicken. There's a Maggie, you recognize that guy. We got Stalingrad as well. Oh, there's so much, so much Yulo potential here. Yamato, Yamato, Yamato. Uh, everything else is pretty scary, though. Yeah, yeah. Baltimore is very, very strong. <clears throat> I do have the relevant. The Masterclass 4 is still relevant now, it's kind of broken. I still think it's very bonkers. I'll play a game because you can see. Santa's on the red team? Santa. I'll play it though. I'll play it. You'll see. Like, you don't have to be that good in Baltimore to showcase how good it is. But a very good player in Baltimore is incredible. You can do everything you possibly want from a cruiser. It's why Wichita is broken, it's just a better Baltimore in pretty much every single way. And there's no need for a Baltimore that's already better, it's got some of the best AP in the game for a cruiser. And... Gwizendor, Santa and Polish? I did not know this. 
Are we in a torpedo center? I don't want a torpedo center. God damn it. Yeah, now the Baltimore AP is bonkers. The HE is pretty good. The radar is great. The maneuverability is good. The armor scheme is wonderful. The maneuverability is god tier because you you, you, not, you you the commander you can get for Israel in Baltimore as well if you have her even if you don't have her still very good. The concealment's great, not amazing, but it's like pretty good as well. How you doing, Jason? Hello, Monk and Company. I believe is what he was saying. As much as I want to YOLO, we have to get the cap. Wichita does have super heavy AP, by the way. Cleveland has super heavy AP, mate. Baltimore AP is, t is, is packs more of a punch than Wichita AP, yes. But at close ranges, the difference is very, incredibly minimal. Actually, it's not even, it's almost not even noticeable at close range. No, Cleveland does have super have heavy EP. Uh, that was confirmed by Prince Blood. That is confirmed 100%. I can guarantee that. Sargon is very unforgiving, except uh, just like Tarkov is good as what it's set up to do. Tarkov and. Uh, like, like, like Alaska is reported audience people just like Call of Duty. I can guarantee it. Cleveland has super heavy EP by the way. <clears throat> and yeah, it's it's kind of insane. Not gonna lie. It is kind of insane. Got split up briefly, but we're okay. Don't die before I torp you. It's not your job. Your job is to die when the torpedoes hit. Okay. Okay. Okay, good. 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 I'm glad you understand. There are many caps like it, but this is mine. We've only got one set left. I don't want to kind of save it for. You broke my torpedo chip, you mother ducker, mud ducking, you lucky son of a. He broke my one. The torpedo chip would have killed him, I guarantee you. That would have been enough to kill him. I waited too long and he broke my torpedo chips. Sorry guys, that was my phone went off. Ah, oh, he broke my torpedo tubes. Oh, so that's frustrating. You know what? The RNG was not with me. I could have got him. I was gonna kill him and kill the Friesland at the same time. That would have been fine. That would have been my double strike as well. But he broke my torpedo tubes. Oh. God damn it. La nostra squadra in vantaggio. 
Jockey, I think they're very similar. The Stalingrad and Alaska are similar. Yeah, they go different playstyles, I agree, but in terms of they're both super cruisers, they both have the same caliber of guns, both have the same amount of guns, they've got similar reloads, they both got improved pen angles, they both got incredible uh, AP penetration, and they both got radar, they both got heals. Again, <laughs> you know, that's quite a, quite a few similarities. But uh, yeah, I, I, Stalingrad is for a different audience indeed. But Alaska is a very good bow. It's pretty much an AP exclusive, AP exclusive bow. <clears throat> we should win this, but uh, yeah, that was unfortunate. We could have had a better result there. Just RNG kind of screwed us over there. But yeah, we're going to go with the Baltimore now, as Mr. Exiled has requested. Yes. So, I use Absolute Ammunition if you have her. It does help because you tend to overpin a lot of Baltimore. The only downside of using this is uh, you have uh, you don't you don't get citadels on battleships. This citadels on battleships. This citadels on cruisers reliable citadels. Baltimore can overpin quite a fair bit, so I do use a absolute ammunition. This is typically fine. You can run this for a little more succinct. If you have AL Balti, I recommend her. If you don't, it's okay. With this build here, you've got a pretty comfortable 9.9 .9 sub 10 detection. So you've got 900 meters before your radar is actually active here. I think I will before uh, uh, just go for the fully packed here over refill station. Refill station's nice and all, but I think fully packed is a better option here. So yeah, that's what we'll do. I'm gonna go with Baltimore. <clears throat> but no, Chalky's right, and in saying that the, the the Stalingrad is different, and it has a different place, but they are very similar boats. They're both heavy cruisers, both super heavy super cruisers, and they're like competitive. Like do you zoom it is to Alaska, you know? Uh, it's like ten point six for Baltimore. What I have was for reloading that thing. You can rewind. You can see it on the stream anyway. 10.6, I believe, is the correct version of it. But, uh, yeah. <clears throat> Alright, so, targets. Everything is killable. Good. Yeah. So, realistically, AP in the Baltimore. You don't want to be using HE unless you have angled target that you cannot overmatch, which is pretty much everything that is angled towards you. You're not a, you're not a super duper cruiser. You're just a super cruiser. Uh, bouncing 15 inch, 15 inch, 16, 16. So we can't bounce the Americans, but everything else we can bounce. <clears throat> You're sub 10. I didn't go too much in Baltimore reload, but you can get it. Again, you can get it sub below 10, which is far better than the Hipper, I believe. Stuff like that, you know. Maneuverability is great. Uh, we need a battleship. Do we have the Kansas? See, that's on paper, but the similarities in actual play. Good AP, same caliber gun, same make on ends there basically, in actual play from the experience. Uh, yeah. How you doing, Shire Queen? Hey, everybody. How you doing? Hope you're having. Oh, it's the first time we've seen you, I think. So, yeah. Thank you for coming. Thank you for the thing. Oh, lovely to see you, mate. Always a pleasure. And I call everyone mate, I understand, but I'm just saying, you know. AP on this angle to Iowa. Definitely worth it here, as you'll see. Yeah. Hepper is pretty good, but I don't think Hepper is, is on the same level as Baltimore. Hepper doesn't have the same amount of uh, versatility that Baltimore does of the radar. Like, this is an Iowa, it's not a legendary bolt, doesn't have too much health. It is active, but like, wait until he calls you deer. Oh well, yeah, 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 yeah. You had to get to be a little bit aware of that one, but yeah, we're working on it. Doesn't see him, hold on, I need to wait for this one. Doesn't see him have a better reload, like eight something? Let's see him. You'll have to tell me, I'm, I'm a little bit too focused right now. But yeah, we've just, you know, we're doing some pretty sizable damage here. 
We could be switching to EHE to get a fire going, but realistically I'm actually quite happy with it. Something to note as well, Baltimore, is uh Oh you blew from air on peak hives, man. Oh yeah yeah, probably. Definitely. Oh he's already dead, wow. Aaron, I love Aaron. <clears throat> hive as well? Alright. So we're gonna swap here. Do you look like a really good hive? <clears throat> I'm you know, the DV's dead. In this case Hepper could push in here. Yeah, no, definitely. Alright, let's see. Push in here. So Hepper Hepper and Baltimore could push in here. Hepper does have also have the 27, but I think uh, Hepper's engine weakness is pretty darn, darn annoying as well. So there's too much chat. Uh, hold on, just give me a minute. i got to read this. Oh, Charles Martel. Yeah, Charles Martel definitely has its uses. But Baltimore has better AP and I think it has be it's just better armor as well. How close was he? I don't think he was that close. I'm gonna pop the radar. I don't think it's a good idea. I keep pop sonar but I even need to. We're gonna fire AP him. I'm gonna switch to AG for the Baltimore for the Z23. Maybe best play here, but I think it was worth just getting the extra AP on here. Nah, it wasn't. Charles is definitely a good boat, yeah, but I don't think Charles has much utility in like a close up, like a brawl situation as compared to Baltimore. I guess it has torps, but like, I just think Baltimore is better. I'm trying to think of the reason right now, but I'm honestly not sure. It's just very good. It's very tanky. It's got great AP, good pen angles. Is that landing? I wish he could be. Yeah, you see. They have bonkers as well. Now is the time we pop our sonar. We push in here. We're not even spotted. I'm gonna have to, um, Chalky, I will read your messages. I'm gonna have to go back, but I will read them. I'm just gonna have to see. Can I pop a radar? I can definitely pop a radar. Radar is just really nice. Yeah, Martel doesn't have the utility as well. The same utility this thing has. Like, you can't contest a cap like I'm doing. This game here. You just can't do the same. Baltimore's also got respectable AA, I believe. Not that it means too much, but yeah. French AP is no joke though, I, I, I can't discount that. If Martel had radar, yeah, I think it might be both more level. Yeah, well, I, yeah. I also think uh, the like the plating as well, the armor of, Mar Mar of, of this thing is insane. Are you gonna I don't have a chance to shoot him? The thing about Baltimore is it's the shell arcs do leave a lot to be desired. Oh, I mean, it's not the shell arcs, the velocity. you got to give it a bit more lead than normally. Oh, can, we, can someone shoot that DD, please? Get him out. How you doing, Michael? French EP is insane? Yeah, yeah. No, French EP is no joke. I can't discount that. If you're comparing the Martel, to the Baltimore, I think the Baltimore still wins, but the Martel does have a good say in the matter. Can we try a blind fire? We're just gonna try a blind fire and see what we get here. I never have bad luck with Martel. Well, it's very rare that I actually don't get a, a Citadel of Martel. It does have spaced armor, yes, but like, it's very easily killed as well. You have to be lucky, whereas with Baltimore, you have a very good armor scheme. 
like if you look at Wichita's armor scheme in Baltimore, really isn't that much of a difference, and I think we can all agree that Wichita's armor scheme is broken. That's absolute ammunition kicking in right there, by the way. Instead of the, uh, the pain, instead of citadels, it'll be pains. Look at the accuracy as well, and yeah, there we go. He's out of there. Like, I can, I, yeah, it's, oh, how you doing American meat? How's everyone doing? Barry, thank you all much for joining me, good goodness. Didn't expect this much for a turnout, to be honest. I'm quite pleased, very pleased. So yeah, we're just going to push in here. Radar's off cooldown soon. Uh, what do you call it? <clears throat> what is Z-23 still alive? Well, that's unfortunate. We can push in here comfortably. We just got to be a little bit more careful of... Uh, do that. And then we're just going to chill by this island here, I think. Indianapolis is over there. We gotta fear Kansas though, we gotta give a healthy respect to Kansas, that's no joke. Ooh. Michael, the Akazuki event was clean? Oh, thank you very much. The Earth Chief Open Fire was there, yeah, 100%. I was so tempted. The temptation was there. You saw an open fire. Like, you wouldn't take too much damage from it, but, like, you could see the problem behind it. How you doing, Peppy? Everyone's popping in. Is he dead? Oh, well, he did a wee... he did a duke. Eh, I'm gonna like that. How you doing, Kansas? Okay, you're, you're pretty scary, Kansas. I'm gonna give you some healthy respect. But you give it, you, again, this is the same sort of thing you'd give everyone respect. Baltimore is more of a stationary like cap contester. You can play a lot closer. Martel, you have to play at range. And I'm going to switch to you actually first time in this battle. Except for shooting DDs, of course. How the games been? Alright, been pretty good. I'm playing Baltimore, so realistically I can't complain at all. The accuracy there, the fire chance, let's just check, is there. The, look, at the, look at the precision as well, we're not even spotted and we can shoot over the island because America. Yeah, yeah, Baltimore is insane. We can play the Martel after this, by the way. We're going to have to like bump up the Martel game a little bit though, because I don't think my Martel is fully upgraded. It's just a solo stream tonight, though I might feel up divisions later on, maybe. Alright, just gonna stop. Full stop, thank you. There we go, just pick up the high caliber, and we're gonna switch to P. Is he gonna die to that? No, he's gonna die to that, that's unfortunate. Alright, we're gonna switch to E. American arcs are great. I don't know anyone to talk about American arcs are great. The only issue with American shells is that they are slow, so they're harder, they're easier to dodge. You're spotted. You can, you're spotted from space, though. I know what you're doing. You're spotted from space. All right. Okay. Got okay, he loaded. Wait a little bit. And no, he's far. Oh, he's not that far. Hey, buddy. Lovely day for a kill. Enemy destroyer sunk. What's the other duty? I can ski. I can't. I can't. I can't ski, as they call it. Mm, Sharny. That was nice.
We're just gonna casually cap here because we don't care. Nothing they can throw at eyes that will really hurt us anymore. Kicking ass and taking names. Switch to AP. Like, he has to shoot HES. There's nothing he can do. No, no quacking. This is an average Baltimore game. Like, there's no denying that. You can shit AP all you want, buddy. You can just visually push this the uh, uh, Sharnors, no problem. Yeah, just murder. Just murder, cause yeah, Baltimore. So yeah, 150k game. Yeah, typical Baltimore game. That's why I barely play the bow. It's just it's just such an easy thing to play. No quacking, no, but that's such is my life. Alright, let's go up and read Chalky's debate here. Alright. Alright, so this is talking just before anyone else has popped in. We're discussing here is Alaska or Stalingrad but you know what, let's do a poll. What ship is objectively Stronger overall. Alaska. Let's just say stronger for randoms. Let's no, let's go arena. No. Let's go for that. Let's just go for that. Okay. Now, Chalky thinks they're different, but in a, di in a good way. They're different things, okay? So, I'm going to read what Chalky said, okay? Chalky thinks... Let's see. Here we go. Neither is better. They just aren't really similar enough to compare. It's like Call of Duty and Tarkov. They do different things. <clears throat> and in a way, she's 100% right. Stargard is very un unforgiving, just like Tarkov, so... Tarkov, you guys don't know, very competitive, very serious first-person shooter. Kind of an RPG is that if you get shot, it, if you get shot in the arm, your arm will become unusable. You might not be able to use it. You may, you'll have a limp or something like that if you're shooting the leg. All sorts of stuff. Very serious. Whereas COD is point and click, very quick, very death, repeat, rinse, repeat, quick, quick, quick. You know, you can get shot a bunch of times in the head or a bunch of times or whatever and you'll survive as long as you have a certain amount of hit points and so forth less serious <clears throat> so Stargard is very unforgiving and uh, it's good at what it's set out to do Alaska is the broader audience for people you know like a call to do sort of play style and uh, yeah so let's see da, da, da. all right Stargard AP is best in class there's no competition Alaska is very good by the way good as you say yep yeah. Uh, but when you look at the results for a broader range, you'll see the extreme difference of play. Alaska AP is very good. There's no denying that. And Alaska, uh, Stalingrad AP, I'm not going to deny, is better. I do think Stalingrad AP is only a little bit better, though, in comparison to Alaska. Alaska AP is bonkers. <clears throat> but you got to play them differently as well. That's really important. So when she was playing Alaska and comparing her results, the average shell smack in the south of Alaska was 9 to 11k with Norman Scott and a stand grabs 11 to 13k. As you see, there is a rise in damage, the AP is better, but the difference, again, not that much. 9 to 11, 11 to 13, you know, with the Savo or average with Kuznetsov. Alaska was less accurate, but I think Stalingrad is still more accurate, but only, much, only a little bit. <clears throat> So, yeah, improved pen angles as well for Stalingrad as well is something to note. Alaska also has improved pen angles because it's American. So, yeah. 
And uh, from talking, experimenting on our own, uh, experimenting doesn't count citadels. Uh, from my results, uh, experimenting that didn't count citadels, I couldn't get consistent ones with Alaska, I couldn't get consistent ones with Stalingrad because it prints them, but I couldn't get a thing. Again, maybe it's me. <clears throat> Alaska could really carry games, but probably Stalin. Mm, it's, it's, this is a tough one. I'm going to leave the stream on for quite some time. I'll leave the, the, the day on for quite some time. And while we're doing it, might as well. Should we play Stalingrad? Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Pick the Stalingrad. Put some boosters on as well. Eh, uh, ba bum bunk, ba bunk, ba ba bunk, ba bunk, ba bunk, ba bunk, ba bunk. Bye, right, folks. By the way, 15 likes if you guys want countings, just so you know. <clears throat> it's my typical rules out there. 15 likes, eh. Uh, As Chalky said, Alaska is more broader, broader, broader audience style of ship, whereas Alaska, uh, uh, Stalingrad is more focused. Versatility though is very useful though in determining what's an overall more competitive ship. <clears throat> Ladies, I think we clearly know that Mino is better than either. <laughs> Probably the case. But that being said, you know, in terms of if we're comparing it to playability and usability. Like, can anyone who picks up the ship play it? Mino is not there. Neither is Stalingrad Alaska is the easiest to play, without a doubt. There's no denying that Alaska is 10 billion times easier to play than Stalingrad. Dog like 69 oh, that wonderful name. Morning, monk and fellow captains. How are you doing, sir? Nice to meet you. I believe is also a new one, so picking up some people. Always a pleasure. Nice to make our wee community bigger. <clears throat> If you haven't already, by the way, if you've seen our wee cool wee Alan boats you've got, I'm going to swap a couple out again. We've got more for the different season. I'll be zoning out the Christmas one soon, so, you know, if we still have it, use it all we still can. But those are some of the emotes we have. Uh, we've got some wonderful members in the chat as well. Chalky, the wonderful, the crazy. We've got Jason, American Maid. Uh, who else we got? we got Moon Cookies here as well. Got some wonderful members, wonderful members. Wonderful people. So yeah, Stalingrad, you want to sit back as much as you can without a reason, but I say sit back, you want to be supporting your team as well. There's a difference between, you know, sitting back and supporting your team, and they are very different. So, it's really good at bringing down the supporting fire and just murdering things. Alright, Alaska here. Accuracy is great. Penetration is great and range is pretty good. No, was that a good shot? Could have been better, but it was not a bad shot. I don't think it was a bad shot. I think we're, we we did what we could with what we got. Is he gonna beat himself? I think he is. Wow, he reversed so quickly. You guys see that? We missed completely, wow. Mm. Russian shell arcs are not ideal for shooting over islands, but they're not bad either. I don't want to use a radar for just us, for an Alaska. Just give us a bit more information, folks, come on. Mr. Stealthy Spartan. Are you really the Spartan that is stealthy? To be fair, like, a Spartan that's stealthy doesn't really, like, you know, tell me too much. Like, if he's if he's constantly shouting when he's fighting, you know, he's not really that stealthy, is he? Oh, oh, you know. Don't mind me. <laughs> I am playing very passively with the enemy team. <clears throat> If you clip a Mino shooting your Stalingrad, yeah, no, Stalingrad is definitely, if you're by one in a Stalingrad versus by one to Alaska, the clear winner is tankiness in Stalingrad. Stalingrad is 100% better in tankiness. This thing will sustain. You know, if you play this boat correctly, this boat will sustain, like a champ. 
though you have to be completely heavily angled in order to prevent any 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 shenanigans from uh what do you call it at other alaskas and a yamato can never match your upper bow as well so as much as we all talk about uh them jiggies what are you you're gang okay I kind of want to know. I'm going to pop the radar in here. Really? I'd like to see if I'd have to spot him. I know he's a little bit far, but this is a pretty decent radar. Oh, I gave lead. I, be, I was playing Baltimore earlier. This is my problem. Because I played Baltimore, I'm giving lead, and like, you don't have to give lead for Stalingrad. Yeah, like, that was actually a really good salvo. Once the good Stalingrad player is in position, all you can say is good luck dodging. Yeah, uh, you're right. You really can't. It's not very easy to dodge these shells. Look how fast they go. He's 15 kilometers away, and it took like 5 seconds. And... Yeah, tanking right there. for a minute there. It may as well be like three pence my guy. Breaking Gunter, that's always nice. I think Stalingrad may shine in clan battles, I think you've seen. Not sure, maybe. Could be what you're saying. Oh, can we angle and type? Yep, five bounces, five pence, sorry, and we basically bounced everything off uh, Yamato. That does tell you a fair amount. Hello, Mr. Shimikazi Art. Get him six times, you know. Oh, there's a Minotaur. Oh, God. Oh, God. Come here. Come hither. Come hither, Minotaur. Come hither. Oh, you're going to dodge, huh? Actually, bounced off the bounced off the turrets. Wow, you are GD Minotaur, GD. Can we dodge them? We may not be able to dodge this, folks. That is pretty frustrating if we can't dodge this. We can't dodge that. God damn. Wow, you got some range, Conqueror. Wow, we were. This is a risky game here. We need to push back a little bit more. Riga has the fastest shells in the game right now. Sorry, I'm, hold on, just see what's going on here. This is a very interesting game here. Shell arcs coming in to mix. Shimikazi got behind us. Oh no 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 no! Oh my god! 
I can't. Oh, it's a gearing, and I couldn't do anything about it. Oh God. You dirty red pirate, GG, buddy. I couldn't get anything done. That was one of the worst selling card games I've had. I'll play another one. I think I really messed that up. Really, to be fair, really messed up in my part. That gearing RDDs didn't do anything, unfortunately. Not to not to point the blame elsewhere, but RDDs like the fact that the gearing got around us. And did all that was not good. Uh, not good. That was a very interesting... Yeah, we didn't really have much of a team there, did we? I pushed as much as I could, but... They went round flanked around that side there. So I'm going to show you if I can't ping it. They, they, flanked, uh, they flanked around this side here. You guys can see the minimap. They flanked round down this way. And that's when they, they pummeled us, really. So that gearing went all the way down here. All the way down here, down here, down here. Torpedoed me, move forward. He's probably going to work on Yamato next. And there's nothing else to do, really. <clears throat> we held the position, but we kind of just stayed there. We didn't keep pushing him. And if we kept pushing him, we could have done the job, really. Yeah, that was gearing gear. Yeah. And that's pretty dead, Yamato. Yeah. GG, Mr. Red Pirate. Couldn't do it, couldn't get the results, unfortunately. Yeah, don't care what the scoreboard says, the DDs didn't do their job, unfortunately. But hey, we did what we could. We wish we did more. GG, well played in the gearings part, he played a very good game. But yeah, we'll try that again. <clears throat> Riga shells are 965 meters per second, sound grounds are 950 meters per second. It's pretty good, yeah. We're gonna go stand up that again, all right? Because I kind of, I, I'm not really. That was an outlier game there. We did not really do well. That was one me. And when you have that sort of situation where you don't have many targets to shoot, it's kind of rough because you really can't do the spotting for your team as well as doing the work. It's pretty rough, <clears throat> unless you're a CV, of course. I did Alaska. I wrote that there. Alaska. Capital L for Alaska for some odd reason. It's a pretty close vote, by the way. But nine votes in. So far, Alaska's winning, but it's not it's not too far. Italian shells are blissingly quick. They had a lot of issues with that, historically. Because they were so quick, they couldn't actually... They, they ended up breaking the barrels. Read up, Monk. Read the fastest shells. People used to take field petrol teams in the clan finals on PC. Limited petrol is one per side. I mean, they just started running full style and grad teams. Yeah. No, um, on PC, <clears throat> uh, they had the petrol, Petro Pablos, which is a, a very strong ship of the base game, which is the PC variant of this game. Or the warships, just simple War of Warships, not nice. legends. And uh, Stalingrad is also in that game. Stalingrad is a very good boat and for competitive scene. Yeah, yeah. Just call me Sensi, I recognize you, sir. Hey, first time watching, how are you doing, buddy? We're just gonna chillax, we're having a good time, we're having a friendly discussion here regarding Stalingrad and Alaska, because I think it, with Alaska's buffs, it's really not too far off uh, Stalingrad. It really is, it's not too far. Petro is still far, well, Petro is not in the game, not in our game, so I can't comfortably comment, because I've not played the, the PC version of it, and I don't really want to play the PC version of the game, to be honest, I quite like the Legends variant. And that's what I'm going to base my decisions off. I'm not going to base my decisions off what's happened on PC. i got to base my decisions off what we have currently in the game. Peppy, if I can't join you, i got to beat you. Let's see. You could also be in my team too. Just saying, you know, the option's there. Do we have any Yamatas? We have one Yamata. Okay. Ooh, we can't really get a good shot there, can we? Gear first. Gear first is looking for a very good smacking. But how you doing, Mr. Sensei? Three new people. I really appreciate it. Always lovely to join. Yeah, Alaska is definitely due for a nerf. I am saying, like, it shouldn't be the way it is. I understand how Alaska currently is, and I think it's a little bit too strong for what it is, what it supplies to the table. It brings everything to the table. I don't think it brings anything wrong to the table. The only thing it kind of can't do on its own is kill a DD, but 
When you get that much firepower and that much everything else, you can kill everything else, then just leave the DV to the enemy anyway. You've got the radar as long as you have a somewhat a team that can think and ki think of killing the DV, then you've got a good chance of winning. See all this here? Like, Stalingrad can tank all this, and this is really, you know, pretty bonkers. Well, not really, but it's like, yeah. The Stalingrad is not one for for shorting off. It will easily take it, no problem. Very good in that regard. Ooh, got a lightning. I need to be paying more attention, to be honest. I'm not really... not really fully focused on this one. Oh, God. Oh, that was a minute. Oh, yeah. I need to be paying attention. What do we got over here? Let's take a look here. Yamato over here. Kerfirst here. Utiloy over in Alpha Cap. A Minotaur over here, so he's kind of holding the cap for us. He's playing He's playing the DD. Which means I'm going to give him some support as much as I can. We've got a Massa over here. We've got a Kerfirst here. It looks like we've got, or we had at least, a lot of. That's, that's the Minotaur. That's Minotaur Torps. <clears throat> we knew the Minotaur was here anyway. Which is, can you dodge them, sir? Oh, they're right out of juice. Very good. Alright, we might, we're going to pitch forward a little bit, and we might pop our Raider, actually. Duggo. Can we try... Let's try the AP on here. Let's try it. Does not help us out. That does help us out. Mr. Mino, that's unfortunate. Wish they're still there though. Oh, what was that? We got robbed. Shocky, where am I? What did I do? Huh? What did I do to deserve that? Huh? What did I do to deserve that RNG? Because that RNG was just plain awful. That was just plain awful. That was, I don't know what that was, but that was awful. Like, Stalingrad's just not agreeing with me today. Four over pens. Yeah, Stalingrad's just not saying no. Oh, we, we, we messed that up really bad there. Oh, I'm so sorry, Chucky. I can't do the Stalingrad badly. Not in front of Chucky. I gotta do my job. We did our job, we pushed them out. Look at that angle by the way. That's America for you. Pen angle bonkers. That was it should not have been achieved. That wasn't it was that a symptom? Isn't like eleven K for like a massive citadel? It might have been. That's unfortunate. I'm getting some really bad luck with the Citadels. What's going on, Joggy, huh? What's going on? Like, all we need to do is defend this camp. We've won this already, we just need to defend the camp. 
We could or match the entire armor scheme of the Minotaur. Bar the turrets, I guess. Let's see. When we're spotted, we need to wait a good amount of time and then we'll see what we can do regarding Mino. Master's down. My, oh, mine is just a water man. He's just, he's just going. It's very ballsy, man. As it should happen. But to be honest, I expect the death strike. I'm not expecting. I don't want just one citadel. I want more. You can turn whatever way you want, but. This should kill you. Wow, man. This guy's getting lucky. What is going on? What is going on? Minotaur is legendary Omaha? Oh, you're not wrong there. Alright, yeah, that was a good dodge. I gave you that. Still trying your best here. You're not gonna survive this, buddy. I think I have a lead, I think I have a bit more lead next time. I think he baited me to get, like, oh, oh, he's gonna fire this way. I sh what am I shattering off? Like, really? This guy got nine lives! What are the lives this guy has? It's insane. How much lives this guy has got? Some insane lives, man. What is it going on? I'm going for him now. I'm going to get him anyway. Nothing else I can do. Just die, please. I've, I've had enough of you. Jeez. Yeah. Jeez, man. Like, what is going on in my, my Stalingrad? I can't. I can't get Citadels, man. That's a freaking overmatch the whole part of him. If I, if I was in Alaska, he'd be dead. Simple as that. Do I have the range here? Is he gonna get me? Oh, he has the range, he's gonna get me. Bugger. Such a lucky... Oh. If I went that way, I would have done it. I would have avoided it, but like... I just can't get over the fact that he wouldn't die. He should have been dead ages ago. I don't know where I'm bouncing off, really. It should be a win anyway, but still, my god. I say that, I'm like, I'm gonna get a little bit hesitant now. He just needs to kill these BBs. Like, yeah, was it just my was it just my work there? Like, I don't know. My RNG's been really bad today. 
GK, just about to top the GK, the one torpedo ship that's available, like a three, not only does he not, he doesn't, he breaks it permanently, just at the right time that I'm going to use it. That's when he breaks it. He breaks my, my, my torpedo tube as I'm going to use it. Permanent break, even though I had a damage control available. And it's the only one out of three, by the way. There's three tubes there. He uses that particular torpedo tube to break. And he breaks it. Meaning I can no longer get a double strike, a kill on the Friesland, plus the... I can't get the kill on the Friesland plus the GK kill as well. Yeah, even if he goes down, we're fine. We just need to wait out the time, really. That's all he needs to do. That's all he needs to do, sir. You don't need to risk it. Send torpedoes, and that's about it. You don't have to do anything else. Just do it through it, that's all. You should be fine. <clears throat> but honestly, Chalky, tell me, what am I doing wrong there? Because hmm? I don't think I'm doing anything particularly wrong in that game. Indeed, yeah. Now, that, that whole game is just, oof, you know. So we got one Citadel, and that was on a Minotaur, okay? We'll play Alaska next, we'll see. He just needs to run away, that's all he needs to do. I can't believe that, that Minotaur got away with blue murder. I can't stress that, that is insane. Anyway, we'll, we'll do what we can. It is all RNG at the end of the day, yeah. Well, yeah. Nothing we can do about it. We just gotta chill. That's that. That's how it goes. That's how the cookie crumbles. And it's Chalky's RNG though. Have a good game in, in Alaska. Just a, just a mess of pure Chalky. First hit will be like three Citadels. Ooh. Uh, the thing is, the Minotaur is completely overmatchable by Alaska. The Stalingrad, sorry. Alaska as well, but like, there is nothing that you're... I'm literally shattering off the Citadel. That's what I'm shattering off. Or the gun turrets. Even the gun turrets might not even be that. Might not even be up to par to bouncing the shells. They probably are, but I'm not sure. 999. 997 and you're firing at the end just the cheeky wee fire at the end there <clears throat> well minutes are pretty well we did okay a lot of minotaurs are about would you agree monk we need less legendary light cruisers and less battle cruisers well to be honest we just need more legendary ships I don't have really much I think I have everything legendary at the minute let me see Take off that. We have 10 legendaries plus. What's the new rental? Is that the special? Special? Rental legendary. Plus the Colbert and Yama and a Minotaur. So that's 12 legendary boats. We have basically no cruisers as well. Good new divisions and countdowns. So we have 15 likes. We shall do that, sir. That is, those are the rules that we have set in place. <clears throat> so, this time Alaska, make sure to take off this punch through skill. And, uh, yeah, we'll go with this and we'll see. So, yeah. Honestly, I think there's nothing wrong with this build. I think it's fine. This extra... fully packed as well is kind of useful. You need the extra reload. 17 seconds, if we bring this down here, it goes down to 17.1, 17.1, what is this, 17.6, yeah, 0.6 per second, realistically not much, really not, now it's 17 likes, damn, that was, that was quick, <clears throat> we weren't too far off, off, far off anyway, but that was pretty good, alright folks, so, ugh, we got countdowns, let's see, all right so we do countdowns and over here this with this side of the pond we do countdowns via voice I will listen in to my own <clears throat> when you hear
So I'll listen to their own stream, by the way. <clears throat> and I'll listen to my own stream, and I will go when I hear the words, okay? So, when you're ready, guys. Legendary tier. <clears throat> so, three, two, one, go. There we go. <clears throat> so I literally listened to my own stream. It's, so far, it's been my most reliable method of working. So as soon as you hear me say the word go, you press the button. And if you're in a vision, you have to give a little bit of lead as well. But I'll do a bit more. I'll do a 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 next time. <clears throat> 169k elite on Sangrad. 69, delicious. Yes. Shockey is, is right in that regard. There's no need for a vote on that one. <clears throat> We are also featuring the fancy, fancy Alaska, like, Christmassy winter camel slash thing. Now, did we get anyone in? Uh, might have been an interesting count in. We got Stalingrad, Chalky in, in her Stalingrad, versus the Alaska. Well, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Captain, so I'm going to do two. You just, you still sound like Flambo. Well, there we go. It's not intentional, I have no idea. He's Finnish, isn't he? I actually quite like Flambo as well, so, yeah. Kiki Mix Gaming, he also won a crate in his in our wee giveaway streams that we did. It was the first one, I believe. <clears throat> he does not sound like Flambo. See, there we go. I don't think he sounds that. Hello, hello. Is that, is that, you know. That's Flambo, isn't it? Flambo does. Hello, hello. Hey, guys. I'm more like it does, hey, guys, you know. He did it. Gavanagh. That's how you say it, American ladies. Governor. Governor. <laughs> I don't know why, but I'm suddenly playing the Alaska Lake Stalingrad now. Oh my god, I need to get... Like, when you're switching ships that have a different playstyle, as Chalky says... And she's right, by the way. There's the Stalingrad. Yeah, okay, no shatters, no bounces, pretty consistent damage. You gotta give it a little bit more lead than normal. Bouncing. Take three came from a Stalingrad hit. Run to some heavy fire here. Ah! Now, if we were in Stalingrad, we could probably tank this pretty comfortably. But we're not in Stalingrad. And we probably need to go dark, and we'll probably do that. We can just go dark, anyway. Something to Stalingrad, unless you build for it, is not ideal. Stop shooting me, Jockey. I don't have time for this. Ah! Okay. Ow! Ah! Bad! Bad! What are you doing? Huh? This is the battleship's job, I'm playing this like a battleship. We gotta be careful. Yeah, we need, we need the battleship to take some heat, but... The problem is, I don't want him to take too much heat, like this guy. He's going full broadside, unfortunately, and... I understand he's doing it to dodge torpedoes, but... Yeah, you saw that. Enemy we can just go dark, though, and disengage and fight whenever we want to fight. Like, me shooting here is on my own volition. I could just go dark if I want to. Not a problem. Just get cheeky four pains. You know, we did take quite a big hit, yeah. And I think that was more on my fault. I'm going to blame myself for that one. Because I just got too close. Double double Kerferus plus a Stalingrad. There's no denying the Stalingrad AP is very good. Probably swing the vote a little bit. Depending on what's going on here. He's done nerf the IGM battleships tier in 7? Yeah, 100% agree. They were strong, but only in their very good hands. That's the problem. They nerfed the eye when we gave it back to us with uh, Missouri. 
Uh, he's right. We don't need to be focusing on these guys. We need to focus the other guys. Luckily, though, I don't think Chalky has this particular range. She might. That's a word, but it doesn't. We'll have to see. All right, just clipping a couple shells, but overall, oh, she has range. Ah, she gets one citadel. That's not nice. So far, I don't think we bounced a shot. That was a nasty hit. God damn you. Jockey's kicking in. She's pushing, she's pushing forward as well. She's only 15k away, which means she's definitely possible to get some really nasty damage done to us if we're not careful. Yeah. Take a shot. Oh, he's backed up. That was a bad shot on my part. Just messed up that shot. What do you think, Moon Cookies? I'm ready when you are. Oh, okay, we'll pop in if you want. Right, uh, as I said, I was thinking about doing it. I was like, eh? Incapacitation, not a Citadel. The one to beat though, because we've been playing so poorly, we still need to beat one, so, like, yeah. Blah. We had a pretty mad game with the uh, with the Stalingrad as well, so we're gonna do what we can. We'll play a couple games, we're not gonna do the whole stream though, just like do one or two. We're gonna have to play carefully here. Moon's been here a while, yeah. Ready for Kansas after the buff? Oh yeah, Kansas is... Good luck with that, that's gonna be good. I thought he'd slow down, honestly. But he's not, so I have to see about that. Let's get hurt. I can't push this, we just gotta keep pushing back here. Our team's not interested in pushing. I can't be the front line of defense here. Oh, we got two shadows in the banner. Pen angles, pen angles, my friends, pen angles. That's that's gonna be the death. That's our death. Oh. We lost a gunter again. Wow. Yeah, I thought Stalingrad gunter was were squishy. Bad Hepper, who said you could do that to me, huh? to get the fire off before I could go. Oh, we did it even worse with Alaska. What's going on? To be fair, we had a really bad team. Not to please blame on anyone else, but like... Yeah. We had a pretty rough team. Well, we gave Stalingrad two games. We'll give this one another game here. But we'll wait, because Miss, uh, Miss Stalingrad here, Miss Chalky here, and our Stalingrad is kicking some royal butt. At least, uh, no kill. Well, she's got to kill, yeah. But the team is absolutely r just ripping as a new one. Yeah, just to get the care first. You can push. You, this is an expertly played. It's well played uh, Stalingrad game, to be honest. Not gonna lie. You're pushing in here. You've got support. This angle here. You've got broadsides here. You've got broadsides here. You've got broadsides here. Yes, I know it's a DD. You still get broadside. And the other team here, your friendly comradries, are pushing in from the other side, establishing the perfect crossfire. Because if you angle against these guys, you're giving a, a bow on or a stern on impression to these guys. And that might not necessarily be enough. And if you're angling there, like this, like see how the cross here there? Angling to that, you'll see how the, the Tirpitz and the, the Cleveland Hebbers are. Has a decent shot on you as well. <clears throat> so we did have a really bad start to this game. And I'm going to say we'll do another one. We'll do another Alaska. 
but uh, overall though we can definitely see which who played better uh, Chalky in the Stalingrad or me in Alaska we know definitely there was Chalky in the Stalingrad for this one and I'm not afraid to admit it 100% true not even touched as well well lightly touched I think where did you get it can't even see it can't even see it this Vanguard looking. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah. All right, let's see. Uh, Kansas, get Kid and Nelson probably best tier six errors for credit. Yeah, Kid is incredibly good. You just have to not rely on Tabitas, otherwise they're just not going to get anything done. Nelson is great. HE, AP, the tankiness if you're not Citadel, so the AP, pen, AP penetration damage if it's not as meh, but the HE you burn for days assuming you have the heal available to you and you're not just sustained fire the entire time. <clears throat> but yeah, Belfast as well, smoke, the radar, the sonar, the AP, everything's all good, all pretty. But yeah, Belfast is a hard hard ship to play but very rewarding yeah, it's not that hard but yeah Chalky did okay Blah. okay now Minukiki I'll be with you in a minute I'm going to do one more Stalingrad game on my own just for nice and fairness for the Stalingrad and the Belfast sake uh, Stalingrad and, and Alaska's sake so we'll do one more game we'll do another countdown alright and next game I'll play with Moon alright so sorry for that Legendary game. Alright. Well I need to, I need to be fair. I, I need to be fair to the to the boat, because if I do a division, it's not really a good comparison. Oh, Stalingrad is a great solo ship. I don't know who's saying that. Countdown via voice. <clears throat> okay, folks. So, legendary tier. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Pizza and see. Oh crap! God damn it! God damn it! Oh, I messed up. I messed up the countdown. Well, oh, god damn you! I, I believe American made. Somehow it's his fault. Pizza is here, monk. You distract me, pizza. The bit of my stand grad slowly moving forward is that intimidating. No, yeah, yeah, that is pretty pretty scary. No, not gonna lie, it's scary. I hope it wasn't too much of a misplay. Oh, we messed up our counting. Ay, 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 ay. We're getting there. Uh, supposing that's how people feel right now. The land of fire. Yeah, just one match, yeah. You might still got it. Yeah, we can, we, we've got it anyway. There we go. Just call me Sensei and it's Conqua. That's how you say it, by the way. That's, that's totally professional how you say it. Uh, I don't recognize anyone else. If anyone else is in the game, do tell me. More than interested. It basically bring, makes the kids a lot more fun, I think. <clears throat> Double Alaska, Mainz, Vladivostok, Georgia, Kerfurst. Very easy citadels if we get the if we get the hits. Yeah, we'll just wait one more, and then I'll then I'll play like two 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 games with you, and that'll, that'll be me. We're gonna play this carefully. All right, Vladivostok, Georgia, Kerfurst. We can afford to be a bit more aggressive. Oh, we're gonna just chillax here a little bit. You did indeed sit it in on me, yes. This is Miss Chalky. But you, I think you're much more comfortable in Stalingrad than I am. I, I, you know, I, I play quite a variety of ships. You did kiss me a little bit too rough, yes. <laughs> Just a little bit. Oh god. 
Like, look at the accuracy as well. Absolutely bonkers. Like, that's that's is just as good as Stalingrad good accuracy. I mean, seven shell heads, three pens, nine k damage. That's not bad. Come here, not again. <laughs> Shimikaze! Don't do it. I want I want your help in contesting the camp. I don't want four pens because casually, that's what we do. Gotta give her respect. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Said Dell and Care first. Casually. Look at those shell arcs, man. Actually bonkers. I'm not gonna lie. Let's try radar. Hello, Mr. Gearing. All stations requesting fire. You gonna help us out, Mr. Mr. Man here? Shit the gearing, but I want to get rid of the care first. I should have shot the gearing. Why did I do that? Pop us on out for the sake of it. Main turret critically damaged. What is my battleship doing? Sir, say to see. You're in the chat, sir. I don't know if you can, but can you push in, sir? I, I'm, I don't know why. Maybe, I think it's just a focus though. That's just normal. I'm getting grumpy now. Alright, let's see. Uh -huh. This is a lot of fire. Was that Alaska that murdered me? I need to check that. It might be Alaska. That hurt quite a bit. Oh. We can get rid of the care first if we push it a little bit. I've got Sonar running for the battleship, so... Oof. see what we can do here. We can kill this guy. We can kill him. And if we kill him, we can rush Alaska. Because one Alaska versus Alaska and the Conqueror, the winner is pretty evident there, you know. Alright, come on. This, this might not kill him. No, probably wouldn't. How you doing, Mr. Dexter? He's healing up as well. Just die! Kill him! Kill him! Stations, reporting the position of a strategic target. Why would you die? I think I play these moves too aggressive. I'm playing way too aggressive. Alright, you need to die, sir. Good. Cost me a lot of my health, but my god. Oh. I'm playing too aggressive, I must be. Simply playing too aggressive. Yeah, I need to switch to HE. Except for DD did something. Oh, the D's left us. Is he over there? No. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Oh, God. Said safe, sir. I'm sorry. I'm getting grumpy. We to be chill. This is why we get moo cookies out on the map. Oh, yeah, yeah. Installing the crew too is taking half the day just to get 80 minutes. Oh, I feel you. I feel you. Ok, 
Hyper up tier 6 for a Lincoln. Very good at critics. Hidashi. I need to take a close on the chat here. Oh, but no. Um, yeah. I don't know what I'm doing here. I, I'm just being too aggressive. The Alaska and the Curve first. I think the Alaska. I'm going to rewind the stream a little bit and see. Let me just check. I think it was just the same fire, really. I didn't think I actually took any, any, any major hits. It was mostly just sustained fire. Yeah. Care first, the Miti Salvo plus Alaska. It was just a combined salvo. I was just focused too much. That's the problem there. Mr. Sensei's like, it's bloody, not my bloody fault that you can't play. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm not the best today, but we're getting there. The rest mode, yeah, the rest mode does then load it quicker. Taking too much fire, I had to take cover of my bat. No, no worries, I don't blame you, mate. No, 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 I was taking too much fire myself. Taking too much, we just didn't have any. The DD, we needed the DD. It's one of these games where you just want to play DD, you know? Because that Shimikaze left us. He left us alone. He wouldn't. They wouldn't have been able to. They wouldn't be able to push that much. Because we need the battleship to tank. We need you there. Simple as that. I was there too. I was there here. And I had cover as well. I was able to back out when I needed it. But we need the DD to stay around here. That's the biggest problem there. You know. <clears throat> Alright. Let's see if I can bring in Miss Moon Cookies if she's still here. Let's see. Ah, there we go. Hello. Hi. Goodness. Can you hear me? I think so. Let me just check if the stream can hear us. Can you hear me? I can. You can hear me. Hello? Can you hear me? Wait. Ah, uh, we can hear you. Okay, that's good. That's fine. Okay. I'm just checking the stream if they can hear you. Alright, so what's up? Can How they? Are you doing? Yeah. Yes, they can hear you fine. I'm good. I just, uh, I can only play a few games anyways because I gotta do stuff from my stuff. For your stuff? Yeah. Maybe turn yeah. it down a notch but... to the stream? Just a little bit? To the stream, yeah. Just turn yeah. it down a notch. I don't even know how to turn my mic down. Hang on, let me see. Do -do -do -do. Do -do -do. I think the Alaska is. I think I've been having some bad games, but like honestly, Alaska is so strong. Is it better now? I don't think there's much of a difference there, to be honest. <laughs> I just. <laughs> okay, hang on. Andrew, there. Um, How is Alaska? Um, team? You played oh, quite well, level. sir. <clears throat> you did exactly what I should have done. <sighs> How about that? Well, that sounds fine. Okay, cool. Did you get the invite? I'm it. just a loud person, Monk. You should know that. I know this. I know. <laughs> I'm just following the will of chat, you know? You're streaming, you're like, oh, yes, chat, yes. Can you jump oh, off a cliff? Hi, 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 hi. How much you want me to you know jump? You know what I mean? Like, just a yeah. loud person. Oh, that's fine. All right, so what okay. tier do you want to play? Because you want to go... I can only do... Tiers. Okay, so I've been working on my fours on this account. Mm-hmm. That's it. I've been working okay. on my fours on this account, <laughs> and I know <laughs> Choki and I know Choki hates to like play low. Yeah. Like, I mean, if I jumped onto Xbox, I could be like, "Yeah, Choki, let's do this shit." But mm. I can. I only have like low tiers on this account. That's fine. I'll play the romance. Oh, like you pick okay, a tier cool. five? Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, sorry. 
I meant tier five. Did I say tier four? You did say I tier have, four. I'm, yeah. <laughs> I'm we'll sorry, jump I'm up sorry. then. We'll jump up. What do you think? Here, yeah. watch me run one then. My bad. Ooh, we can run the we can run the heat ray. We'll burn. We'll, we put Godzilla on our side. There we go. Chokey, I'm I'm saying like, a girl, girl, I'm getting on in like on Xbox after <laughs> I hang out with Monk. So I mean like, if you want to play high tiers, let's do this shit. So, <laughs> <laughs> so, but on my PS, I only have low tiers. All right, <clears throat> let me just do the countdown, then we'll we'll pop in. Get the field mm -hmm. potentially. Let's see. Countdown. Tier five. <clears throat> Monk, learn, learn your learn your Roman numerals. There we go. <laughs> Actually, I can't count. You, if we ever talk to Yab, have you talked to Yab Boy about my counts? Have you uh, ever talked to him? Is he not breaking the count? He, oh. he freaks out on my counts. <laughs> oh god. All right. Okay. So guys, tier five. Just in case you haven't noticed, not tier four, tier five. <laughs> five, four, three, two, one, go. I couldn't hear myself there. What's going on? I couldn't hear myself there. Oh, no, I can. Okay, well, that's weird. I think I messed up the accountant because totally planned, totally intentional. Not intentional at all. <clears throat> anyway. And you know what the funny thing is? Choki's like probably coming in for vengeance after saying that she's like, she only plays high tears. <laughs> um, I can see it now. She's coming in at tier six, you know? So high as I'll go. Yeah. <laughs> exiled. <laughs> we got exiled in California. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't recognize anyone else. Oh, Andrew in the Nagato, potentially. If that is Andrew. I don't recognize the actual username, though. I'm going to have to say. And we'll push in, we'll kill the world. <clears throat> That's a lot of DDs. That's always nice to hear. Nice to see as well. As a, as a battleship. Always lovely. Yeah. Always lovely. Uh, I'm going on the outside of A. Oh, the California, this thing is so thick. Like <laughs> Bunk only has one unit for style <laughs> woman, and that's me. <laughs> okay, I'm not sure what to say to that one. God. Are you gonna go in there, kill everyone, and then, like, make me look good? Yeah? As you gonna do? Got it. You just go go into A, kill everything in A, cap it, and then kill everything in B, cap it, killing it at D, then cap okay. it, yeah, and then go back to C and just cap it again. That's what you're gonna do, right? Clearly. So my twist and track thingy is on uh, eleven o'clock. Let's get hurt. Ow. What? Four penetrations for 2k damage? What is going on? A cat. Uh, how did I get four penetrations for 2k damage? That is very interesting. It's not very upgraded. I've been working on it really hard, but I gotta, I gotta do it from far away now. Spot is an A cat probably. Hey, don't push too much because the free, uh, free F, yeah, Friedrich is there. Yeah, I'm just trying to turn because there's an A cat ooh, close to me. Uh, I did spot it. I'm not too sure if you saw. You could gun him, but not with the current support he's got. You know. If you pen the torque ball there's no damage because it doesn't have a damage model. Yeah, but it would have would have it wouldn't have shown it would have shown as a torpedo protection hit, I believe. I believe. I could be wrong. But that was, that was disgusting. Oh. It was far away. Well, we can't quite far away. away. The biggest threat right now is the gate. And the Friedrich, of course. Come on. We don't got that medal yet? Maybe. If you can spot the Friedrich, that's really good. Well, 
Wow, really? Yeah, yeah, I just have to come around the... I'm, I, I'm slow, you know. I fired 10 <laughs> shells at the California, I got one hit. Uh, what is going on? Is Fizzle <laughs> even... Even Fizzle's doing me dirty? What's going on? It's not possible. Fizzle's my bull. It's my bull. It's my jam. I do wanna... Turn it right there. Oh, we get really abysmal salvos. What's going on? <laughs> you got a lot of support here, though. And they got a lot of TTs. <laughs> My god. Uh, it's radar? Sonar. Like sonar? <laughs> like, uh. There's no sonar. Well, there is there is radar to your vibe, but it's not very common. <laughs> I was just like, ah. Oh. <laughs> there's no cruisers in this tier. There's no cruisers in this game anyway. Unless there was an orca in this game, that's the only way we can get radar. Stop hitting me. They're so mean right now. I try to save the technical terms because you know you never play with me, so I can't be like all cutesy. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's um, at the door. Oh, okay, yeah, have fun. <laughs> I used to somebody's at the door. Is that the technical term for it? No, I was. <laughs> I was just like, that's why I was just like, I was like, that's why I was just like, you don't know my my the, the terms, so I was just like, uh, I better <laughs> say it right. No worry. No. Like worries. when people play with me, they they don't really say much, and then I when I say it wrong, and I'm like, shit, <laughs> and then I was like, uh, and they'll be like, that's Cookie's way of saying there's she's been spotted. <laughs> I was just like, oh, sorry. Oh, no worries, no worries. I'm not too far off the, the base values of what I'm saying as well. Can you rush and spawn no. up that ACAP? The ACAP Wookie? Uh, he's on. He's yeah, in the smoke good. screen right there. I can't really ping it too much, okay, but cool. he's there. Uh, my, wait, am I... Oh, okay, right there. Yeah. I'm just in... I'm in spotting view of, I think, the ACAP because mine's 6.6, .6, but let me just turn a little He's in the smoke screen, so... He's in the smoke screen, so he shouldn't be able to see me. No, he can't see you, no. Unless he okay, pushes okay, out. But then you'll see him, and I've got the jump. I've got HG loaded, so. Like, okay, I'll kill cool. him for you. Just, you just spot him. Plus, he's probably going to torp me very soon. He's probably left us in the screen to torp me. There's his speed. That's one set. That's two set. Well, I'm spotted, so I'm not too sure. Well, he could have left, you know. And there he is. He's buggered off over there. Oh, exile! It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. You can just disengage, you don't have to shoot. Just turn away. It was a calculated well, I risk. I because my rudder is gone. <laughs> it's okay, he just might get shoot. hit by my oh, corpse. No. He might- Oh, oh, he's turning, he's turning! Oh, nope. No, he missed every single oh, one, no. but I'm burning out. Bye bye, monk. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> that's okay. Oh, I, remember, I'm in a man hand that's barely full. <laughs> I remember I was practicing. I was working on my. Okay, shifter. <laughs> I actually quite like how you said that. A man hand. <laughs> oh, sorry. How do you say it? How do you no, say it? I think it's man hand. I, I mean, I'm not American, Mayhem, so exactly. you know, but like a man hand. <laughs> I mean, I'm not never American heard that either. One. I'm not American either, but I mean, like... I, that sounds I wonderful. A man hand. <laughs> How do you say that. it? It's mayhem? I think it's mayhem. Yeah, it's mayhem. Oh, I thought it was a man hand. A man hand. <laughs> Imagine a man calling hand. a ship man hand. <laughs> I swear to God. I thought it was called a man hand. <laughs> man hand. Nobody has never corrected me. I swear to God. I don't mean Nobody to be. Like, you know, it's just... It's just it's just odd, I think. It's just like odd sounding, I don't know. A man hand. 
then Blake's mind hunt. Uh, oh my, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no comment, I'm just gonna stay away from that one. Oh, Alright, Exile, this pop to me and you. Andrews is coming. Yeah, he's, he's doing his thing. Oh, okay, never mind. Wasn't a fair fight, unfortunately. All right, Mr. Friedrich, it's me and you then. This time it's not personal. All right, come on, come on. Your tiny guns. We're dead on points, we're dead on ships, and we're doing what we can. Yeah, I was hoping the Akat would get spotted, I could blap him before you, and then you could torp Mr. Exiles, and that would be all, you know, sunshine and rainbows, but no, unfortunately. Ooh, the DD's right behind us, that's good. That is good news. Because it means you have a chance to kill him, a chance to actually carry this game. For sure, Exile. Good game. It was a good game. It's GG, sir. <laughs> Is it just me? I feel these pens are not getting much damage out of them. It's six pens. That should be a sizable amount of damage. I don't think it's that much, to be honest. With the way currently things are currently standing. In your secondaries. Oh, we got Andrew here. He's still he's still hanging about. He's much healthier than I am. Lost a gun to her. Oh well. Whatever we do. Do what we can here. It's all up to them to lose now. Basically, they need to be. They need to get greedy. That's all they need to do to win. To lose. Sorry. They need to get greedy. Come on. You know you want to get greedy. Come on. Uh, look at this. Look at my fancy. Look at look how dark my ship is. Like it's absolutely like just. Oh my god. It's like atomic bomb testing. Jeez. <clears throat> I like your ship with a little bit of blue on the bottom. Yeah, we'll see that soon. <laughs> that's, 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 <laughs> certainly no, will. But like, if you see it, it's like highlighted, like the electric blue on the bottom. Oh yeah, 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 yeah definitely. Yeah. <laughs> so you're just like, we'll see that. So I'm like, no, it's right there. No, we will. We'll see the underside of it as well. I'm pretty yeah, sure. Me and got a bit ballsy. A little bit. We still can't win this. It needs to be both of them need to play recklessly. Oh, I've got Walter Build. I forgot about that. We still can't win. I'm trying not to spend any of my silver. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm literally trying not to spend any of my silver because I have the Hipper unlocked on this account. Ooh. But, I'm 10 million short. <laughs> Just 10 million, yeah. Just 10 million! <laughs> <laughs> Just 10 million. You'll be fine. Actually, I lied. Sorry, it's 9.1 million. Oh, how like dare you. I think I can speak to you again <laughs> after that. Not after that, such blasphemy. <laughs> oh, God. I was going to push forward there, but Andrew was putting that down to run into him. Uh, the B Mayhan's left, the Benson, sorry, is it the Benson? Yeah, Benson. Benson's left, he's not even interested. Akat's probably sending torps this way, so a good idea for Andrew is to actually start sailing right. But, it's just we gotta be careful. Oh, there's torps. Yeah, we 
He might eat one. Might eat one. No, we're good. Okay. No. He did eat one myself, but Nikito's got pretty decent torpedo protection. There's the Nikito. There's the ICAT torp that we just spoke about. Probably gonna eat two. And that's gonna kill us. Yep. And he's gonna eat his couple as well. Yep. Oh! Kraken as well. Look at him. He was very <laughs> lucky. He got away with it. <laughs> he could have been deaded. Alright. That's GG Andrew. Picking up High Cal and Nagato is no easy feat. Definitely. GG. Alright, we're not having too good now. Our run of games has not been too winnable. We're having pretty sizable losses every day. We've won. Oh god. Oh god. We've won three. All the games we played. To be fair, like no, all no, three, not no, you. No. I was talking about. Sorry, am I muted? No, no, no. No, no, no. So what you feeling? Um. Okay. I'm also working on. My... I think I need to play something very strong to try and make me feel better. <laughs> okay, I'm also working on my G22. Uh... <laughs> that is definitely tier four. Just confirm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. I'm, okay. I'm highlighting it right now. <laughs> okay. okay. Well, what should we play here? Let's play. It. Oh well, no. Mm. <laughs> and then this is my last game because I gotta, I gotta get back and I gotta get on. So. All right. Let's just. Let's, uh... I need a. I got pushed down to. Um, I was at. 25 and then I got pushed down to 90 and then I got back to 50 and then I just gotta finish my back to 10 or go up to 10 and then just be good because tonight's the last night right hmm. yeah one day left so I think I'm gonna go some really... Rocco actually I wanna go a DD I just wanna I just don't want to be like helpless you know <laughs> so it's gonna go for the DD <laughs> and guarantee it yeah you know <laughs> I know, Michael, you want me to go a veal, but no, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go Sirocco. I'm gonna go with the spicy <laughs> French. They're very spicy, you know. Eh! Uh, <laughs> let's try this again. Alright. So, tier four. Four. Count down. Five. Voice. <clears throat> Alright. So. We go for the five, four, three, two, one, go. Okay, there we go. Ugh. I quite like the German DD line. It's quite a fun line to grind. Like, it feels satisfying firing those guns. Though they don't really do much, but it's quite satisfying firing them. You know? <laughs> you know? Don't know why. Did we get anyone in here? Let's see. We've got Steel Boost. Captain Who. I don't recognize anyone here. I might have gone down earlier. Probably because I did double DD. But I wanted to get. I want to get a solid win here. <laughs> I want to confirm. Um, but what do you think? What do you think of the T twenty two? I like it. I actually have it on this account. As I like to go the uh, the German way. It's actually a pretty good line. Yeah, it's a pretty good line. That's what I was saying. Yeah. Yeah. It's a pretty fun line. I quite like it. It's very satisfying firing those guns. Well, since you got four Sorry. DDs, might as well push this camp together. If you're up for it. Okay. Yeah. Once you get yourself sorted yeah. out, I don't know what the hell's going on over there, but I'm just going to, you know, casually ignore. No. <laughs> <laughs> just leave it. Um, go. Alright, what do we got? We got double T22, a Mehan, a Manhan, sorry, and a Mitsuki. <laughs> if you're going to start calling it a Manhan, everybody's going to be like, you've been talking to Cookie. <laughs> 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 but you can't accuse me. I'm just gonna be like, I don't know where Mom picks that shit up uh -huh, from. Uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> so... 
<laughs> now, the, the couple of names that I've got as well is uh, Zarkun saying, you know the Miyoko? You know like the, the fancy blue dragons and all that? The Miyoko? The Miyoko dragon so, okay. camels? The, the, okay, so... Okay, so whenever I sit there and look at it, you guys are like the it's it's like S spelled M Y uh K O or I can't remember M Y U K O or something like that. So when I looked yep, at I it, you guys are like Miyoko. But the thing is my like when I was talking to him, like when my dad saw it and I was just like, Dad, look at this thing and He's just like, Yeah, it's the uh the Miyoko and I was just like, Yeah, that's how I pronounced it too. But like people said it's like the Miyoko and I'm like he's like, No and I'm like, Okay, whatever. Cause he watches me play this game. Mm -hmm. Or should I beached? Okay, yo, I just pulled a cookie. <laughs> Hang on. Let me just help you out here. Oh, what what was that oh, show? Oh, there was dispersion not. there. Oh, <laughs> that wasn't me. Let's see. Okay. Okay, so what is this? Uh, 7.5 and 9.8. Oh, you're actually okay. I thought you'd be hurt there because you're beached yourself there. I thought, oh, they're, they're going for you. No, but... no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm very good at beaching and getting away. <laughs> so, okay. I just wanted to let you know I'm very good at that stuff. <laughs> Got it. Master beacher. Yeah. Got it. Yeah, I am. I like to lay on the sand, eh? <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Somebody's contesting me in here. Yeah, you've got and... the two DDs in there. Just be aware. But there's the Matsu right there. Yes, there was a Matsu right there. But he's not going to be there for much longer, so don't worry about him. Oh, oh no, I actually might dodge this. Hold on. I say this. He's going to get fair amount, actually. It's not gonna... It might not kill him, though. There he is. Ah, oh, shit. He's behind the island. Oh, no, he's dead. Okay. Kule. No, I was talking about the Miyoko, sorry. The, the yeah, Miyoko, Miyoko, or what do you want to call it? Um, okay, yeah, the Miyoko, yeah, yeah. You know uh, the variant wait, the that has, like, the dragon camel on it? I only know the eastern dragon has Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, like, the, the, okay. the western and eastern dragon. Uh, Zarkun calls them Strip Club Miyoko. Because that's the way, that's the sort of, like, fashion style on it. And that's one of the things I've picked up, you know? Like, that is definitely what I'm calling them now. <laughs> you know, there's, there's no denying that. Oh, but the, yeah, strip club Yoko. It's such a, it's such a, an aptly named thing as well. So you know the island on my right side. Mhm. Mm oh shit, there's a few still. There's a DD there, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. I was supposed to say yeah. there's a T twenty two there. Because well, making this Sirocco work, will... it's not a bad bull. Like the French DDs are great. I just don't. It's not, it's not as good as the Jaguar, I think. Ooh. Here we're good. Let's go. Go hit my second set. Oh, nicely done. I was like, let's go. He'll hit my second set. Let's get out of here. <laughs> let's go. Let's run. <laughs> so... You know what? It's fine, you know? Fine. I was hoping. I, I, I think it would have had him if yours did. So, so, I was like, whatever. I was stressing a little bit because my smokes was going and he was literally four kilometers from me. You're fine. So. Am I going the right direction for the DD? I don't know. You said that about my man hand and I fucking went man like, hand. <laughs> so. so what's, what's the ship um, called? What, what's the ship I'm in called? Um, you're... I want to hear this pronunciation. Hiroko. Oh, okay. I'm a oh, French Canadian, right. remember? Uh -huh. Okay, so you see that right? Okay. Right. Yeah, okay. I'm like, I'm a Canadian. So this is my you, turn. You can't pull that over my head. Man. So, Canadian. So, you keep calling me an American, but I was like, I'm not American. I'm not I assume American. everyone's American on the internet. I'm not usually, usually not wrong as well. You know? Yeah. 90% so, of the world is American, you know? Still convinced that T22 was captured a fishing boat and heavily modified. Let me take a look at T22 again. Yeah, no, actually, not not far off. Not far off. Yeah, it, look like, it does look like a fishing boat. Did Where's that DD gone, by the way? 
you, I don't know, like, where did he go? Because you just literally ran around the island, I ran right? after him. Okay. Literally, ran after him. <laughs> Whatever. Fine. Whatever. He doesn't want to fight, I'll fight him later. Oh, there he is! He's bucket off down there. Alright. Like, he was healthy as well. There's no reason for him to run. He could have okay, helped so out his teammates the... and done something, you know. I'm shooting because... You got that. You, I can see your torps on him. Give him my way back. The torps are messed, yeah. They were very influential. <laughs> he's not aiming near you anyway, so it's fine to shoot. Plus, he's, he's one of two people left. This is a pretty rough game for them. I don't mind open water gunboating in French DDs, it's not a problem. Come on, last shot. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Pew pew! Yoink! Yoink it! Yoink it! <laughs> I'm sorry. That's <laughs> 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 just. <laughs> no, no, no worries. Oh, no worries. <laughs> you got it? Oh. No. Oh, you got it! Yeah. Hey! I was We're trying to yoink those two, though. I was trying to yoink those two, though. So. Get there. Don't worry. You know, I would have got a Kraken. I mean, <laughs> no, no, no. Why not? Okay. If I yoinked them all, okay. then I would have got seven kills. Yeah, if I would have yoinked them all, I would have fine. <laughs> yoink it. Okay, I got to go because everybody's asking where I am. Well, congratulations. It's <laughs> very good. Very good score. A good result. Yeah. Honestly, that was very good. That was a pleasure. That yeah. was fun. All right. Okay. I'll catch you next time, then. Alright, bye for now. Definitely. Bye. Alright. Oh, there we go. That's, that. That's the, the wonderfully mad Moon Cookies, you know, kicking some butt in the T22 and uh, taking them kills. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Now we go here, and we're going to dismiss this division, and then we're back to normal. <clears throat> Alright. So. I like to play the high tiers, so let's go for. How long have we got, actually? Let's see, how long have we been streaming for? Eh, Alright, we've got, still got some time. Let's go Akazuki. I kind of want to play Akazuki. Yeah, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling the DDs, man. <clears throat> that indeed was quite funny. It was quite funny, indeed. Alright, let's see. Tier 7, folks. Are you all ready? That's the craziness of uh, because If you haven't seen her, she's on Twitch. And, uh, yeah, uh, I can't really tell you too much more because I'm pretty sure I'm getting demonetized on YouTube. <laughs> Mad, there's a box of frogs, that's all I'm going to say. Uh, very difficult way to spell it as well. It's like, oh god. Follow? Let me see if I can find it. I'm not recommended channels. Twitch is, I do not like Twitch. If he didn't know, didn't like Twitch. Follow the channels. Let's see. Go here, go to here. Two things, guys. <clears throat> Two minutes, folks. It's a bit of a noise thing. I'm going to sort that out. Two minutes. <clears throat> Michael, you're off to make a few friends. So I'm glad to see the content come back. It must be glad to see December over. Yeah. A uh, lot of stuff. I'll discuss you with that later if you want. But yeah. Two minutes, guys. Sorry.
Okay, sorry guys. Just a little bit of a noise there. I wanted to sort that out. Oh, yeah. No, the, the, the coming back to content, yeah, I was kind of struggling to make the content, but now I've got it back on track. I'm quite happy with it. So, yeah, tier 7, guys. Let me just get this going here. Tier 7 ready, folks. <clears throat> so, <sighs> alright, going for the Akasuki. Phil Jones, hello, Monk in chat. How are you doing, buddy? Oh, alright. <clears throat> so, tier 7. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, go. There we go. <clears throat> but yes, how are you doing, Phil? Hope you're having a good time, sir. But I'm actually happy about it. Like recently, the channel's been doing a lot better. I'm really happy with one about to one point one five k, one five, one point one five. Pretty good. I'm really happy with it. The views are getting relatively high. I mean, not as high as it could be, but like, I'm still very happy with it. <clears throat> Sounds like a fan on computer. Yeah, sorry, I can do that away for you. <clears throat> I don't need it technically, but it's nice to have it. It's not the PS4, it's my actual computer fan. I'm running on a PS5, so I don't actually have that problem. That is the issue there. <clears throat> it's my old laptop that is performing as, as an old laptop does. Oh god, we have a Shikaku. Well, to be honest, if I was to have any DD, a Shikaku would, would be the ideal one I'd find. He's got less planes, and the planes aren't tankier, so yeah. Yes, yes, P yay PS5, yeah, we're we're fancy up in this joint. <clears throat> Alright. And yes, we're not running twist and drag. We've opted for more range. <clears throat> Is Mooncook on the PS? Uh, both platforms, I believe. Uh, obviously, uh, the reason I division, because she's on PlayStation. But I'm strictly, strictly PlayStation. Because I'm in the vain hope that they'll release crossplay one time when we're old and grey. <clears throat> we meet again next child. <laughs> Beautiful. Now, I normally would pre talk this, but I know there's no DD. There we go. Got Z23. Is he going to push? I don't think he's going to push that much. The craziest American, you say? Well, to be honest, this is a very tough ask because we have certain people that exist, like Solisto and Solisto and Solisto. You know, it's pretty rough options there. You know, don't care if it's about me. I'll just work with it because the CV's there. I'm gonna get spotted anyway. Oof. Was that was not consensual, Alaska? Was it consensual? What are they doing, huh? We gotta get that respect. What are these battleships doing? Well, to be fair, it's more me than battleships folk. You blame it on people for mistakes, man. Come on, let me do it. Barely. Yes, you see you. I know you see me.
That's a lord. We know he's present. Yeah. You've got me spotted, sir, but it doesn't mean you have me sorted. Where are the other DDs? Akizuki, another Akizuki. Alright. I think that's the Shimikaze, though. More than an Akizuki. Shimikaze are tiger. But he did miss the book, point tiger, of course. Got some crazy figures here, I tell you that. Yeah, what was here? You've got dual purpose AA as well, so. We're actually gonna do a not bad job of kicking these planes. Smoke is pointless. Because this sonar lasts forever. Can we get it? No. The Lionel Trains catalog. Yes. If you guys don't know, Mr. What is that? Akizuki Low Health. Oh. Come hither. Come hither. What are we fighting? Z23, which is already low, and the Shimikaze, which is not going to win a gunfight against us. Which means we move forward. Forward! On to the abyss! We need to waste our tops now, guy. Looks like he's going to die on his own volition. Shimikaze is going to go down now. I guess he keeps playing well. One, just finish him off. It shouldn't be hard to kill. Very good. All right. Now we can't chase these guys, but we can put some work in. Hello, Shimikaze. Okay, buddy. Okay, I'll give him that. GG to him, buddy. GG to caddy as well. That was a lot of torps. Yeah. Okay, I underestimated that, Shimikaze, not gonna lie. Ah, uh, yeah. I mean, those torps got the job done. Like, I was pushing forward, the speed boost was on. I just had a little more speed, it would have been alright, maybe. Probably not. GG, though. It should be a win, though. We've got they've got a Z23. We have a CV though. I mean, you could push a little bit more forward, but whatever. Um, pretty coercive team. Alaska versus Minotaur. Well, we'll see what happens here. And and well. Went a bit better, a bit worse than I planned, but it's still alright. <clears throat> if these Bismarck shoot the Alaska, it should be pretty rough there. For him. It's like 6k? 5k? Z23's putting in work. Z23's over there. Is Parcel gonna dodge? Parcel's gonna move. He's firing AP bombs at the DD. Maybe he just doesn't have a choice. I hate that slingshot's used, so annoying. I'm just a little bit off of that one. Get the to beat bombers out, man. You're lurking there. No worries, let's fight. <clears throat> he should have no problem killing the DD. Uh, Alaska and so forth should have no problem murdering this thing. Per Yamato. Let's see if have a rough time. He's reversing. This should be a solid win. <clears throat> we didn't really get our result here, unfortunately. But I was expecting better, to be honest. Not gonna lie. Not going to lie. I was expecting a bit better. But hey, well. 
Parcival torpedoed the DD because it's Parcival. And yeah, pretty rough game for the enemy team. And I think it's okay. Didn't do that great. Could have done a bit more. Let's back out. <clears throat> I don't know, guys. Oh, what do you think? Oh, you guys are looking and working. Well, I gotta make it interesting for you, so you know. How far away are we from the campaign finish? 120, isn't it? Yeah, 120. No, so 130. Ooh. Legendary tier? Okay. We'll go Ishiroku Yamato, I think. I think Yamato is what we want to run with. The gorgeous Yamato camo. Such a nice camo. <clears throat> oh. Legendary tier. Count that. Count down. Fire. Voice. No. Before I do this, we're having a really bad time here. The RNG's not with us. I don't recognize Alaska. And boats? No. Must have been Seraph or Dunno. Weird. Alright. We shall go with the Yamato. And we'll do our typical countdown ways. So that is five, four, three, two, one, go. Then Bowens was you. Yeah, okay, there we go. Because I was trying to work out that. Who, who, what is your PSN or your ID or gamer tag, where you go to call it? Because <clears throat> I'm like, which one was it? Because there was two Alaskas in that fight. And I, I think we... I don't know if he died. I don't even remember. So, I know we killed the GK, but we didn't get anything done there. All right, let's see. <clears throat> hey, we got Potato Bra in the enemy team and his Kabarosk. We have uh, Kiki Mix Gaming in our team in the Claver. We got Exiled in the Alaska. And I don't. Rob Owen, the Worcester. Is that the. Them Bones. Ah, Them Bones. It could be a different person. We do not actually know. I don't recognize anyone else, but if there's anyone else, do tell us. Gariga? Oh, sorry, someone was telling us supporters. That's nice of him. Where is he at? Where are you at? Support this guy. Support this guy. Support this guy. Let's <clears throat> just go back. Yamato's not moving an inch. This'll be fair. To be fair, they don't have a DD. We have a club air. Do you know? You don't know. The matchup is pretty even. Two Yamatos, two Yamatos. Two, two Curfers, two Curfers. Richelieu, Bismarck, which will we win that one. Uh, Worcester, Worcester, Alaska, Alaska, Riga, Baltimore, Club Air Cabros. Very similar. Though it's a bit of a shame to be in a cabros when like you don't need the it's kinda rough. to this guy. Decent. We can't shoot a cab right now, but we will the minute we have an option to. Because he's scary and he's our moderator and he's terrifying. Mister. Let's just trying for the we still look cap here. See how that pays out for him. To be fair, you might dodge these. 
got a feeling he won't dodge everything though. Eh, why not? As long as it's resetting him, that's really what matters. <clears throat> Shoot Alaska because I think Alaska is more of a threat. But we could push forward a bit more. I do want to be hanging back, and you know, even at the Yamato, it's just I don't want to do it. <clears throat> Where is Rika? Breaking your guns? Yeah, that's it, we're right. You're taking all the brunt, buddy. That's why someone needs to push up for you. Black hole? Let's see. But you still need to get back. We missed that but completely. So far, so good, folks. Four minutes saved. We barely done any damage, really. We want to get rid of this. Uh... Oh, Alaska's not too much of a threat anymore, now, is he? Yeah, we're getting rid of them. As I want to support Exiled here, I need to be careful and not get death struck myself. I gotta give that plenty of respect. And we gotta be careful that we can't give this guy too much broadside. side. I overestimated how much he was moving. Yeah, not that much, but still. angle for too long. Did we have that cheek? We aim for it, that's for sure. But, uh, ow, ow, ow. Do what I can, my friends, but I'm not getting the best results here. The spare shot hit him. I love it. Thank you. All that's left is Rigo. From that flank. I really want to push in. for this salvo. Ah, oh, it was such a beautiful salvo as well. Fire on the 
He is in a good position, you're right. Yes, summons of Francesco Yulo. To be fair, though, this is a bad idea. We shouldn't be doing this, but... Because we're risking this broad site for another. Oh, what is going on? Carefree's got the right idea. Don't shit me out, so I know you don't want to do it. Ooh, that dispersion does not like nice. <sighs> you should have died, sir. Yeah, that's what should have happened to you. Keeping an angle and it's not what I want to do, but like I don't have a choice, do I? Okay. We did dark, we went dark, good, good, good. Uh, don't crank it, crank crank up the volume. Alright. You said there was clearance. You're wrong. Oof. I think he's a little bit too close for our liking. Not sure. <clears throat> Well, yeah, this is a very accurate commander build. I don't think nerfing his accuracy was a bad play, in my opinion, but hey, whatever. Get back, you see? I don't get too far back. I'm actually quite happy here. We're contesting the cap. If the... If Francesco Yulo becomes one of us. Oh, God. Oh, no. Exiles. No. Exiled. No. Oh god damn it. I'm sorry. Go forward. Forward, sir. Forwards. Prizing guard. Or whatever you want to call it. You've got the space. You've got the gap. Get moving. Good boy. We got it. GG, buddy. You survived. I'll hold this side here. Don't worry about it. He survived. Oh, he's going for the ram, a ram, a ram. He's going for Shazam the ram. Next shot, I will definitely get him now. I'll go right there. For the turret weak spot. I could just ram him, but that's, there's no fun in that. Let's see if I bounce every shell, though, because typically I will.
At least they don't care for us. Can they? He's gonna burn me down potentially. Nigga versus Wooster. Lose this? Oh my god. We're actually gonna lose this potentially. God damn you, Mash. God damn you, Mash. He picked up a Kraken. Look at him go. My god, Mash. What did you do? Who did you pray to? <laughs> Alright. Worcester, come on. Kill the Stalin. Kill the Riga, sorry. Something crap. If you kill the Riga, we have time to win this. GG, mister. Oh my god. Oh, Worcester just lost so much health for that. That's not good. <clears throat> Alright, let's see if uh, MASH figures out what to do, because... Why would he go broadside? Oh, I don't know. I wasn't paying attention to that particular part of the battle. I don't know, sorry. I don't know. If I knew, I would have done something about it. Potatoes. Ah! Oh, he knows. He knows. No! Don't do it. Basically, what he has to do is I have to can tell you that because there's not much time left. He has to kill the Worcester. Capping won't do it. There's not not enough points in the game. He's got five kills. Worcester just needs to run away, and he's what is he doing? Is he charging ahead? Oh God! Why? This is a stressful one. You're not going to get there in time? Stop typing and start moving your boat! <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Ay, ay, ay. GG, Mr. Mash. You can get closer. Well, you can't do it now, unfortunately. Unless I see any torps, nothing. <sighs> oh man. Run, man. Oh man. GG exiled. GG, man. Mass was kicking it. Didn't pick up the high cow, but he got a. He didn't get a convader, I don't know. It's a, he got the Kraken, he got two Arsehole Awards, and he got Wither as well. He's burning. Taking names. Couldn't carry hard enough. No, no. Too many good players, that's why. Like, everyone here played really well. Like, everyone played really well. Like, that that for the bottom of the scoreboard is really good. This is a decent game. 1500s, 1800, 1800, 19, 2k, 2k, 2k.5. Very good. Well, well, well played. This guy also played really well as well. 1600 on a loss. And Kabarosk of 1975, that's a 3k game almost, I think, if he wants. Very good. Very good. <clears throat> Riga played well. See, Potato, you had no faith, that's why. You clearly you said you would lose, that'd be a fair game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You had no faith, sir. The skill level on you guys is way higher. Yeah, yeah, no. No, no. You're right. Oh, alright. Let's think here. Oh, I don't know why. Let's do Colbert. No, I, what did I play last time? What did I play? I played Yamata, didn't I? Yeah. So let's do Colbert. Yeah. No. I'm not going to type in chat as much, okay? So I'm just going to do this on my own, okay? Hold on, I'm going to go back.
Uh, let's see. Alright, so. We've got. Yeah, you didn't. You, I didn't want to say a potato because I, I wanted to win. <laughs> you needed to cap. You didn't need to cap. You need to straight go for the guy, you know? You just shouldn't have gone to A. After you killed me, you push forward and you should have got the Worcester. But again, hear the moment. This thing happens. It's not easy. It's not easy to predict what's going to happen and what, you, what you're going to do in the heat of the moment. Prime example is when I last played the album roll and put that video up, album roll bloodlusting, where I got too overconfident and just pushed forward and it didn't work out for me. <clears throat> Alright, what do you think guys? Clubair or Worcester? I'm thinking Clubair, but uh, I'm not sure. What do you guys think? <clears throat> So, the options there, folks. Colbert or Worcester? And I might end the stream. I might... Oh, God, wow. 37 votes, and Stalingrad has not done well. Holy crap. Colbert. Oh, we had one Colbert, one Worcester. Oh, God. Come on. Like, I don't know how to keep... Oh, God. We got a Worcester. We got a Colbert. It's an Alaska encounter. There is no counter to Colbert. Come at me, bro. <clears throat> I'll wait for one more person. The next person, one or the other, he'll get it. So it'll be Colbert or Worcester. One vote Colbert. One vote Worcester. So we're going to have... Then do Worcester. We've got another one saying Colbert. Okay. Exiled, you're... You can't change your vote. You've already voted. You convinced me to pick Colbert. Colbert? Colbert. Yes. We got the Colbert vote. Okay. So, count down. Ah! Count down. Down. Legend. Terry. Via. Ah! Via. Voice. Okay. Alright. So, legendary tier guys, this time I'm going with the Clipper. Clipper, you all. No, I'm probably gonna die, but we'll see. <laughs> Alright, guys. Five, four, three, two, one, go. You guys hear me? Yeah? Okay, you can hear me. Okay. It's just that hear me on stream there. It's the test there. <clears throat> Hope the counting worked properly. I'm not to see. Exiled in Alaska. There we go. Alright, good. We got Yamato, Kiki Mix Gaming, and the Yamato on the enemy team. We got them bones, I think, is uh, is Andrew as well. <clears throat> oh, God, hold on a minute. Okay. Cablings and all that malarkey. Ugh. I don't mind. Uh, like, I'd rather watch a stream. Clear as speedy as. Like, obviously, to play competitively and play like comfortably, I would hide the mini map, but. I don't mind because at the end of the day, let's keep me on the other team, yeah. I don't mind at the end of the day. I can't watch a stream. I don't think it's good, it's good to watch a stream that when you cover the minimap. I don't want to do that. I don't. I don't think it's enjoyable to watch that. So, for the sake of entertainment, I'm more than happy to show the minimap and do all that. Because if I was playing competitively, I'd have to find a way to turn it off. But <clears throat> I would rather just have a large delay over that. To be honest. Because I'm just not a fan of that. Minimum the complete base webcam? Uh, not really. There's too much. There's not much space here, to be honest. I would just put it like next to my. See my ship, my ghost ship. I would put it like right to the left of that. That's what I'd pop it.
We got Colbert and Lafantas. Okay, so we're going to fill French. Let's go. Mayard, as they say. <clears throat> Cap contesting, not what Colbert's good at. Especially with Wichita and Alaska there. But watching Hive. Hive's a good person, don't be wrong. Hive's good, but I don't, I don't like the minimum piling. That's just my personal preference, but hey, that's just me. Ow! Ah! Damn you, GK! Alright. We're gonna have to play this on very, very, very careful Frenchman mode. It's a bloody good shot with that GK. I thought I had my speed boost on for some reason, but... Hey, Colbert for 6k? What, well, mate? <laughs> They hit me for 16k. That was rough. I'm gonna have to play this very carefully, man. I don't wanna do this. I think here it spots me as well. I'll zone, but I can't really comfortably keep fighting this. This is risky, man. Combined, he's taking a fair chunk as well, but not as much as me. The auto emulation really kills the idea of how high speeds. That GK got a good shot. I should have. I, I thought I had my speed boost on. I thought I had it on. If I had the speed boost on, it would have been a lot of a different story, I think. I don't think he would have had the shot. Simple as that. Both DDs are here. That is really good. That's not what I want to see. Oh, that's just risky. We've got to do something. We can't just let it go away. we got to contest the cap in some way or shape or form. Exiled, you're pretty ballsy. That's all I'm going to say. Hopefully, this Georgia supports you. That Yamato is going to certainly got a safe thing to say about what you're doing, buddy. Initial Zavo is taking me out, man. I'm really struggling. Exiles, pure exiles, getting focused to crap. I did take out Yamato, that's good. Hmm. Nah, I'm good. Well, you're good to you before. It was. This could hurt. Yeah, he's still good. That GK is building off some cracking salvos, I tell him now. Why isn't he shooting? I know he's tarping as a result, but like, you could have just shot me. There's a shot. At least now, but... You had the advantage, buddy.
All right, at least, at least they're not, or at least it's not the only one. Or Fantask is very low. If I get the support, I can push in and capture Charlie here. They're not doing too well on Charlie and Alpha. Charlie at an Alpha side, thanks to Geeky Mix giving Dev striking that freaking Riga. That was unfortunate. Indeed. Come on, turn, turn, buddy boy, turn! We're not on much help, but we're gonna do what we can. <clears throat> If we get rid of those DDs, we have a good chance. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh no, he is. He's going for it. Okay. This could hurt quite a bit. Farewell. Ah! I was hoping it'd be the fantastic. God damn it. We're not doing well in this club air. What is going on? We're just having really bad games, I tell you. Exile is carrying like a champ, but I don't think he can carry everything. That to be is probably gonna happen, unfortunately. Oh. Good damage, but I think it's gonna kick it. Secondaries are the Next main battery gun hit will probably kill him. Or wherever that is. Oh, unfortunate. <sighs> Just the initial salvo at the start really hurt me. Well, GG buddies. Never mind the not good. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Do you watch me? I think this was down to me, not gonna lie. I think I potatoed that Clubber game. I just potatoed that straight out flat potato. The initial salvo was too much. That was just too much damage. Simple as that. Like, the Clubber is low. And if those guys shot him just the same way that GK shot me, he could have got him, you know? Can he get the shot off before the thing? Oh no. GG captains, GG Mr. Kiki. You kicked her royal butts. Oh, the guy did awful. Exile, GG buddy. All right, okay. We kind of we played the, we played the club ever wrong here, very poorly. So we're not gonna let that happen again. <clears throat> not gonna let it happen again. We're gonna go again, club bear. Going again. So folks, if you didn't get in last game, we'll try this game, and then. Then, I'm probably going to wrap it up very soon. It was a really bad game. I'm going to try that again. <clears throat> I'm not having that. Bad Club Air game. Alright. Attempt. I'm going to go attempt. Number two. Okay, we'll do another club air. I'm feeling it. Okay, I can do it. I can do it. Not not taking no for an answer. Club air is club air. Okay. Hmm. You know, I know, we all know. Good. So, ready, guys. Legendary tier one more time. Five, four, three, two, one. Did I meet myself when I did this? I may have done that. No. Did I? I may have done that. No. What is going on? Oh god, let's see. Raw Rambo HD, I recognize him. Exile did not get in this one. I don't recognize anyone else. I think I potatoed it. I might have potatoed it. No I want to do. Agreed, do-over is definitely... Well, uh, I don't know. 
I'm potatoed quite a bit. This is quite a bad game. Quite a, quite a bad ring of matches for me. Usually my streams go a little bit better. But uh, no, not really. Really been struggling. <clears throat> RNG Regan was brought as I to me, so he. So he. I'll read that later. Maybe. So he did? Oh, yeah. Last. If that was the case, that would be. Yeah. Very good. Lennon. Ooh. Odin. Ooh, the camel. Yamato. Interesting camel. Alaska. Ooh. Minotaur with the Union Jack. It's going all crazy. Wister of a nice, interesting camel. Bismarck, a lovely camel. Shimakazi and Fletcher. I don't really like to contest in caps in this thing, but uh, if, I, if I don't have a choice, I don't have a choice. I must contest to the cap. Mr. Odin. Hmm. Suspect to be torps coming through that section there. I gotta be very careful. Brave these people are. You're not doing that, are you? Parking broadside? You're actually gonna park broadside? A tous les bâtiments, demande d'appui feu. Seven glow? I thought it was six point eight or something. Well, if Al Fletcher wants to go over there, I don't actually mind that, like, yeah. doing but all I know is that I must kill alright let's see <clears throat> probably gonna loop around here because I'd love to go through the island there but I can't go through an island as much as Despite how strong the club area is, I can't go through an island. So we can go through here. Got our speed bus going, so pretty quick. RDD, what is that? Yudashi's going down, uh, Shimikaze. Probably not an even trade. Outbound flights. Afternoon haul. How are you doing, buddy? Governor, 
So, and besides, and besides, like, it's pretty good. Uh, everyone's flight gaming's alright. I'm pretty good outside from the two degree weather. Ooh. That's uh, that's pretty cool for those who don't have it. Uh, Fahrenheit, you know, I believe. Two degrees. Two degrees is alright, actually. It's, it's a little bit nippy. It's like borderline cold. It's on the crust of cold. And I'm assuming you're talking about Celsius, you know, the real measurement system. <coughs> I know I've rustled some feathers, but I don't care. Don't care. I'm just gonna go for it. Alright, we got a cap here. Fletcher's dead. Shimikaze's fighting Yudashi and he's getting his butt kicked. Well, I don't really have much for me to do here, really. Yeah, sorry. American units. God damn it. You and your American units. I would cap, but double Alaska is pretty. I'm not going to cap that. American units. Well, I don't know where is America. I don't know what uh, two degrees Fahrenheit is. Might be cold. Might be. I'm gonna turn away already. Go sure. Oh, Doc. Okay, Doc. Hey, Monk. Oh, whatever the this game. You played very well, sir. Very well done, sir. Honestly. That Colbert, you, you, you kicked some butt that game. What do, you, what do you mean you want my help with? What do you want my help with? What could you possibly want my help with? I'm working on it, if that's what you're asking. Oh, of course, run out of range. That is a Minotaur, that's no way I want to fight. That's a long rush radar as well. I want to see... Negative 17, okay, that's very cool then. I don't know who wants me to do, like, you're asking the wrong person. Do you think I can deal with the Minotaur? I mean, maybe, but like, not reliably. I guess. I'm next to a lot of radar cruisers, I don't want to do that. Like, I'll die real quick to Minotaur, this is kind of scary how fast I'll die to Minotaur. You know what, let's give it a go. God damn it. It's so risky, I don't want to do it. It's so risky fighting a Minotaur, man. It's just, it's just not what you want to do. I know the alternative is like, it's, oh, I don't want to do it. It's too risky, man. AP's loaded, I'm ready for it if he come, if he comes or if it is, but I'll be careful with it. He's a smoke with them, so he's not radar. Main battle reload mod instead of top reload? I seldom fire on the reload? Hold on, I'll, I'll read that in a minute, hold on. I'll let you just focus on this bit. But yeah, okay doc, yeah, now you guys you got the better engagement. Now GK really messed me up. It was not pretty. Let's give it a go. Let's see how bonkers we are.
There's one set. Meow. This is a very strange feeling. Rushing a Minotaur in a DD. This is like Ballsy Central. This is this, this is rough, yeah. Music is sure destruction, but Yeah. If he was if he wasn't angled, I probably would have got him. But uh, they got the cap, congratulations. Can they kill the Yamato? If they can kill Yamato, they're still uh, they're still in the game. I didn't want to rush that. I didn't want to do that. I don't know why I'm thinking of it. I thought I'd give it a go. Alright, one thing I've been trying with the Club Air is made by a reload mode instead of the Torp Reload. I seldom fire them on the reload to short range either way. Yes, Club Air is definitely a gumbo. More so than a speed of Because of the short range. And the guns are great on Club Air. Simple as that. It's got good everything, really. <clears throat> How you doing, Shoki? You are back, and I will give you the whole owl and the heart as well, because there you go. Probably should do that the other way round, but whatever, you know. I said whole lot in heart, but I, I wrote it the other way round, because simple reasons. This is terrifying. No, this should be a win. I can't wait to play that. I can't wait to play the Minotaur again, man. I miss this bow. It's such a good bow. Alaska should be alright. I don't think Alaska's in any major trouble right now. Oh, okay. I don't know why you did that. Just turn in through there. <laughs> yes. You're completely right, Choppy. Completely right. Only one unit for style. Reckon it's time we end that poll. Should we get one more vote, folks? We've got 39 votes. Let's make it a nice even 40 votes. It's for Stalingrad or Alaska, which one is objectively uh, overall better, shall I say? In, in the, if we had put it in against a bunch, much, tons of situations, would Stalingrad come out on top or would it be Colbert? Uh, sorry, Alaska. I'm reading Colbert because I'm seeing it, you know? All right. Ugh. Yes, you did give me a lovely smidge for that. And for that, I'm going to play Stalingrad, because I have to. God damn it, why keep playing Legendary Boats? GG. Uh, before I go back here, let's take a look. Uh, da, 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 da. Go beat and go there. Yeah, okay, Doc, you did a very good game, mate. Very good game. Exiled, we have we lost the game, but it was a very rough game for us. Uh, if he's done bit Colbert here. I'll just go to Colbert real quick. We went with the torque mode actually. Because we had decent range, but I think it's a good idea actually to swap off from main battery mods. This is this is before the nerf. So I think main battery mod is a better option here. The only issue with that is the traverse speed gets a little bit worse and it's already pretty bad. But yeah, let's do that, and I think that's perfectly fine. 6.2? Yeah. I think that's a better option now, actually. This was done before... that. I made that before the, the buff, the nerf for the torpedoes, you know. <clears throat> I think the guns are better on Clubair, actually, now. Yeah, definitely. So we'll do the Stalingrad, the shark. The shark that is the Stalingrad, you know. And I wish, I wish I could cosplay, because I'd get double stalling out of me and, me and this chalky. It'd be brutal. 
Legend Dire Tire. And then we'll end things I off. We'll end things with Stun Compressor Alaska yes. We'll end things with the Palo, I think. <clears throat> because it is the thumbnail sequel of, of the stream, so we'll put a wee <clears throat> Let me just see if I can hear myself. Can I hear myself? Okay, good. So, legendary tier, folks. Good luck. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. As they say. No, Colbert needed to be nerfed. I'm not gonna... 100%. Colbert needed to nerf. Um, there's no denying it. It was simply too good. They did Colbert bad by nerfing Dorps. Honestly, they didn't. Honestly, it's still very, very strong. It's, it, did, it, it needed the nerf of some sort, it was simply too strong. 8 kilometer torps with that amount of gunpowder and everything, you know? <clears throat> I mean, it depends who's the to help me, yeah. 100%. Right, Colbert needed a reload nerf, the range just about killed it. No, no, Colbert is still insanely strong. It is, uh, I mean, the 6 kilometer torps, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, it depends who's buying the helm. For me, I've beaten every Alaska when it gets. Of course, as you know, Colbert. Uh, it's a discussion. It is the end of the day, you know. Anyway, sorry, folks. Legendary tier, and we'll get that then sort sorted. So, legendary tier, five, four, three, two, one, go. No, Colbert is still strong. I don't think you can, people can say it's not. <clears throat> it's got 12 torps. It's got insane gun power. The torps are fast. They hit hard. You've got amazing torpedo angles. You can YOLO burn. It's the best, the best YOLO boat in the game. and it, Including the Palo. It's better than the Palo. It's even better than that. The Palo's only got three sets. Of course, that's the whole point of a nerf. To make a ship less effective. <clears throat> we actually still strong, but normally as strong as a pre nerf. Yeah, of course, that's the whole point of it. <clears throat> that's the whole point of a nerf. That being said, they do they, they've got a bad history of nerfing boats too much and buffing boats too much. Kansas is a prime example. Uh, what do you call it? Alaska is a prime example of ridiculous buffing. How you doing, Daniel? <clears throat> It's fast as duck. That's the big chunky set there. Don't let anyone tell you different. I think I need to get schooled. <gasps> Double Stalingrad. Oh, we did it. We did it. We did it. We got Kiki Mix Gaming and the enemy Yamato. We got Exiled in the enemy Alaska. And we got uh, Raw Rambo HD on the enemy one as well. I need to be. I need to play. I need to learn a lot more about how to play Stalingrad, really, because I think I'm playing it too aggressively. So we're gonna be careful here. We're gonna back up a little bit. We're just gonna play it safe. We want to get the opportune moments here. Oh, we got R9 as well. I didn't see R9. Hey, you doing, buddy? Oh man, we got some people here. Oh, this is a Doom's team here. You've got Chalky. We've got them bones. We've got R9. We've followed by his mate Pepper. Pepper, sorry, Pepper, not Pepper. We've got Rambo. We've got Exiled. We've got Kiki Mix Gaming. We've got so many people in this game, and this is a wonderful game here. Oh my god, beautiful. Oh, hello, Minotaur. Oh god, okay. Now we overmatched the entirety of Minotaur, so... Yeah. That's what I was wanting to happen in the last stream. Last game I had with this bow. And for some reason we couldn't get it done.
That was not unexpected at all. It's a Minotaur. That's what should happen. That's also what should happen. Thank you very much. Okay, I got a bit the last one was on it, a little bit unexpected, but that was the Cheek Citadel. Is that Worcester? It's a okay. Got DD here. It's gonna be a tough one to hit. Here we go. Pick a shot here. A little wee. We got we overlaid this guy a little bit, quite a bit. very aggressively I like it <sighs> your team just left you yeah yeah 100% yeah we it's pretty debilitating it's very intimidating seeing two Stalingrad push you you know I mean just coming towards you you know it's like a sort of deadly shark do, 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 do. You know, don't get cut yourself. Exile, old man. This is a rough game for you, sir. Kiki Vicks giving some respect and that yeah it's up. Going for X out? No, okay. Let's pop a radar here. That radar did its job. Wasn't much, but it did its job, that's for bloody sure. Prevented the torpedoes. We... Yeah. Alright, we take most of this out, though. We took him off the cap. Potentially saved our Kansas, but there's no guarantee for that. Russian, but we gotta do something. Another Stalingrad show, and oh my god. Brutal. I appreciate it. 
。ゴムランと蒸気。はい、プリシエイトロ。ウェイトロ。僕はフィルラッシュだね。マイズウェル。Shattering at that range, 18 kilometers, maybe a bit, bit much of a stretch. This angle, you could probably get to the top. Exiled, I know you're going for it, and you know what? GG, buddy, for not running away. Respect, honestly. Yeah, look at that angle, man. Look at that angle. We got a wee cheeky citadel at that angle. That's what happens when you're not fully bow on. Yeah. See, this is where I get too ballsy, man. I get too ballsy this time again. I can just hang here. You give him too much angle, you get a cheeky Zinadale, yeah. Pretty brutal. Now he can shoot HE, of course. I can. But he has infrastructure that I can have. And a gun I can break. No, oh, he's not too healthy either. That is some crazy range. Chipping away. Obviously, we don't have the same. We can switch to HE, so we don't have a choice in that regard. Ooh, them shells. Ooh, we, we fired too much. Too much ahead of us. We know we can. Fire here. Oh, I'm so sorry, exiled. I bet he's fuming at that one. I, I would be too. Permanent gun breakage. Ugh. Ninja that? No, we cannot. Oh. Brittle. 
Sorry, XL. That was a rough game, man. The Holy Crusader sails again. Well, this is nice of him. You guys did try. I think we just had too many people from the stream on our site. Yeah, Kiwi did well, yeah. Man! GG everyone, honestly. There's Chalky just kicking a little bit ahead of me. Very good. R9 did amazing. Chalky did amazing. We got... There's two, you know, everyone did really play well. Again, 1400, 1300, very good games. Kiki Mix, man, for a loss, you guys did great. You had a rough, rough there, rough, rough, rough matchup. But very good. Well, well, well played, everyone, honestly. Yeah. Bit of a, bit of a ruffle stomp, but hey, we, we, you know what? You guys put up a good fight. You guys, you know, three kills in between these both. You put up a fair fight. You managed to kill down R9, which is like. You know, that's, that's, that's achievement on its own. <clears throat> I want to say, I wonder what, what, did, what did Chalky, Chalky, did you get a cap in that mix? I think that's what the difference here, because we're not too far off the XP wise. We'll have to see. Broadside like Yami? Oh, yeah, no worries. Alrighty. Last game for me, folks, I think, because what's the time? Yeah, nearly four hours of stream, so we'll do that. <clears throat> oh, man, wonderful stream, man. 17 people watching, man. <clears throat> Thank you guys for the support. It means a massive amount. I'm more than I usually get. Like, I'm not as big as Zarkoon and, like, t and Spartan and all that. Even just, even Hive as well, I'm not as big as Hive, yeah. I'm relatively small as a uh, World of Warships guy, community contributor guy, you know, but the support man is absolutely love it. Thank you guys so much, honestly. You guys have been a pleasure to play with, alright? You inspire me to do more, and I've got more stuff coming up, alright? So, you know, if you want something done, just post a comment, you know, like the video. Tell me all the stuff there. You know, I'm more than happy to help. Honestly, guys, you've been amazing. All right? Honestly. So, yeah. I'm going to go Mads. I'm going to YOLO. I'm going to Francesco. Okay? And I don't you guys ever play and do that, you know? It was us. For, it was you guys had a rough one. Yeah. No, it, it's fine. I'm not asking for anything. I'm just saying it's been a pleasure. Guys, honestly. <clears throat> so, last game. We'll do the Francesco YOLO. All right? We're not done yet. We're gonna go one more. One more in the list, okay? One more. Tier seven. Seven 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 seven. Seven. Sven. Sven. Okay. Sven. It's not seven, Sven. It's Sven. <clears throat> but no worries, Long Licks, if you're heading off, that's fine, no worries, man. We're gonna do one more. See how long it lasts though. That's the next, the next question. Because Paolo's don't tend to be very quickly. <laughs> well, they are quick as well. Let's see. Alright. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Go. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Honestly, guys, you, you're amazing. The members especially, you guys are particularly amazing because you've obviously helped support all this. You keep me going, you know, every little bit helps and it's just amazing, guys. You, honestly, you, you mean the world to me, honestly. Uh, this year, the best thing I've done is getting a thousand subscribers, I think. Mugs get it for stand with a rude you'd watch you suffer. Oh god. Oh chalky with her with her monthly thing. 
Oh god. Chalky's amazing, honestly. We go exiled here and his Iowa. I support you just once. You can support me three times, I'll support you once. It's fine. Uh, we got Raw Ramble and his Shampagan. We got Friesland, the Chalky and her Friesland. We got. I don't recognize anyone else. I don't recognize anyone else. We got Champagne. Yeah. You missed this one? No worries, mate. There's always an extra. You got in quite a fair amount, quite a fair amount of them anyway. <clears throat> Let's see. Paolo, Elio, Benson. We gotta be careful here. We'll be all right. So Chalky's up another side of the flank. I understand. Jamie Cook says, and then and nah, and they. Okay, I'm not. I, I I would check the name, but I, I gotta be. I gotta focus here. We are potentially gonna be business. Risky though, isn't it? Miyoko, we're in the same cap as a Paolo. Oh God. Jeez. Okay. <sighs> All right. God, man, that was. I do. I lose that health. Thank you, Exad. It was not good, honestly. Should have gone for the first out, really, but eh, whatever. Got the smoke. Might as well use it. And then. Uh, Hold on, I, 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 hold on, just play it. Right, bear. Bear. Oh no. Alright, we'll do it again. <clears throat> monkey 52? No, I don't like that. It's Monkey 52, not Monkey. Wow. Oh my. Jeez, okay. It was Bill and Waddle. Not by you. You, sir. Or was it? It could have been the game, George. I don't know. You guys can handle that. I can I can go that. Tell Jamie to play Monopoly. <laughs> Pepper on a cliff. Oh, I saw you were a Cabros last game. <clears throat> You don't support run away? Oh, no worries. I was on the other side of the map, it would have come sooner. Yeah, the Belfast didn't need to, could have supported you a bit more, honestly. I wasn't there, so I can't see, but like, I think the Belfast, it would have been better if the Belfast supported their destroyer. But that's, you know. Woulda, shoulda, coulda. Place Toy Story 3, the video game. Uh, I'm good, thank you. No, no. We're playing about Ark. I don't know if you guys are interested in that. Since Ark 2 is coming at some point and all. They'll be coming Ark 2. Let's see. This is risky what I'm doing, but I think. No, I don't want to get too aggressive here. Ooh. Jockey didn't. She didn't go out with a fight, man. She took that Benson down. Oh, it's okay, Doc. <gasps> He's there as well. Oh, no, I want to see. No, I want to do. I 
I don't want to torp DDs in the panel, I want to torp everything else. <laughs> you know? DDs are not part of the mixture. Honestly, I don't need to do any more here. I'm just happy staying here. Thumbs up their butts. That's what I heard. shooting in the tag room. Danno critico al motore. Problema risolto, signore. Danno critico a torretta principale. La nostra squadra è in vantaggio. Alright, we're gonna smoke up here. Generatore di Don't want anything to do with that. I get nice and high copy. Wow. Okay. God damn it. You know what? Again, everyone shot up here. It's always good. It's always good when they do that. It's good teamwork, but my god, that was rough. Oh. I thought I could get away. I thought I could get away. How do you say scone? Well, there we go. Answered your question. Well, they actually, reading out your question, answered your question. Huh? How amazing is that? Uh, that is the Benson, I think. Blind fire. You know you want to do it. Blind fire. Blind fire. Oh, no. That's the least two. One... Dodge the second one? No. Oh, he swung the body too much. Ah! Oh. Mr. Dog, man. Kicking the butts of everyone here. What's going on? Oh, Richard Lou is on 279 health. You'll be fine. Don't worry about this, Salvo. Nothing happened. It's not there. It doesn't exist. Oh. Ooh. Well, you win some, you lose some. Jeez. That was Kagero Torps, bruh. Yeah, he was there. It was Kagero plus Benson Torps as well. I don't know if the Benson Torps were also there. The Benson was also there. So, yeah. I died to the Kagero, I think. Sergeant Plop. I quite like that, not gonna lie. Dimply Paprika. Ah, okay. <laughs> we have a beer. <laughs> Wait, at this point, you can't do everything. You can't, you're not gonna get the perfect team every game, you know? You win some, and you certainly have to lose some. That's just how the cookie crumbles. Oh, right. Mr. Doc, man. You got some quality torpedo skills, man. Very good. Sarshin Plop. It's fired AP as well. Pretty interesting. Good show. Well, yeah. Jeff Shreden. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Jamie Cook, Scottish Independence. What do you, what do you want about it? You think, honestly, you think talking about politics is a good idea, sir? In a stream, sir. Squire, sir, sir. Reginald? I don't know why I've got Reginald saying that. Alright, let's see. <clears throat> he didn't get out of That guy there got a really good one. Do you think of the ball? <laughs> uh. 
No, it's not a bot. Who's a bot? Man, very well, good play. But this Kagero, Mr. Doc, I think he's gonna top top the scoreboard. I think. In terms of who's gonna get top scoreboard, it's either me or Exiled. I think, cause Exiled did some work. Who did he kill as well? No, no, Bayern's not gonna get top spot. No way in hell. No way in hell. It's either myself or you, babe. You know, this is not bad, actually. Baltimore might, might pick it up. <clears throat> Respectable man. Okay. I'm glad. I've turned into a respectable man. There we go. Now we know. Alright. Winnable. It is winnable, but we're just a little bit ahead, so we need to push in and get the B cap. Whether that's possible with the ships we have, that's risky. Vanguard and Ganizer are both 15 inch guns, so Baltimore can push it. That being said, the Benson's really low and the Kagero is not exactly healthy, but I think he's a little more than half health. So if Bayern pushes in and does what a Bayern should be doing, which is getting aggressive, <clears throat> we'll have to see. That was an unlucky shot. You should be pushing in instead of turning out. If you pushed in, you could have got put a lot more pressure on the Vanguard, giving a, a broadside. Kagero is a lot healthier, actually, much more healthier than I thought. It's up to what these two DDs. There's the Benson. If someone could shoot the Benson, Belfast, they can't turn his turrets in time, possibly. No one's interested in shooting Benson, mainly because it's probably too far away. Belfast could maybe have done it, though. Baltimore's tanking. Belfast is bow on to the torpedo thread. That being said, that's a very nasty torp. Look at that. Let's get a hem bang on. My god, what a lucky torpedo spread though. Holy crap. How close is he? I don't know what his detection is, but... Oh no, you're firing. How did the Baltimore go down there? How did he go down so, so quickly? To a Vanguard and Gnaiz now. It's about tanking them. Interesting. Alright. <sighs> At point, Kagero can indeed be Belfast in a 1v1 here. Gumball Kagero plus a torpedo boat for the win. Jeez, man. Got smashed by Vanguard. Ah, oh, okay, there we go. Yeah. Goodbye, nice Ganizer now, man. Really kicking it. Ganizer now and Kagero, man. The MVPs of the enemy team. 100%. Oh. Alright. It's up to the Bayern now. I don't think a Bayern can carry this. Losing gun turrets, giving flat broadside to both Gunaisnow and Vanguard. That's not ideal. You need to be shooting the low health target that's giving you broadside, not the angled threat. Come on, sir, just kill the Gunaisnow. That's all I'm asking. You've got time to do it. Fire the front guns. No, 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 no. Ah, that worked. Man, this guy has no accuracy salvos, man. What is going on? What is going on with this, this guy has no, man? Like, accurate guy has no, man. Holy crap. He hit a Paolo running away at, like, this sort of distance as well? At, like, 15 plus kilometers, he hit me from that distance? 
I mean, to be fair, it was only one shell, but like, oh, all I don't need it is one shell. There we go, he's decent, man. That can ice knife, man. I can't get over here accurately like an ice knife was. Oh, we did not do well. Well, it was the bullets were picked up some slack, though. Yeah, we had a rough game. It's a rough finisher, man. OP dog, man. Let's see dog. I thought we did better, to be honest, yeah. <clears throat> Very well played. What a carry in your team. I get nice on that as well. Very well played. Alright, folks, that's all we have time for, though. Honestly, guys, be the blast, okay? Not be the great res no, uh, not be the great uh, number of games. We've been losing a lot of them, to be honest. Picked up near the end, but holy crap. Be the pretty bad uh, turnout in terms of performance. But hey, you know what? That's all that matters. We got a good, we got a good run, so. Yeah, we've done all the now. Done our Roy effort. We haven't got the Kraken yet. Oddly enough, you haven't got a Dreadnought, which is kind of funny. All right. Folks, as I said, I will see you next time. Bye for now. Always a pleasure. All right, let's see. Da, 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 da.